Sonny, I need those dishes clean. I just got adopted by Weird Strict Dad Melon. Who you calling weird, boy? Ugh, and he ended up grounding me. I have to find a way out of this house before it's 6 a.m. You're never gonna escape from here, Sonny. Otherwise, my Weird Strict Dad is gonna kill me. Hey, yes, I'm looking to adopt that big, annoying yellow kid. Oh, are you talking about Sonny? Yeah, yeah, the one that's like pretty much an adult and he still lives here. Hey, Sonny, Sonny. What is it, babysitter? I'm taking a nappy. There's someone here who wants to adopt you. No way. Finally, I'm getting adopted after all these years. Melon, what are you doing here? Ah, you will make a fine son. Big man, Sonny. Very strong and large. You'll be able to do tons of chores for me. Babysitter Steve, don't let him. Don't let him adopt me. Sorry, Sonny. The paperwork is already signed and he paid. You are leaving now. Dang it. Come with me son. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, break the window for me, son. Okay. Faster! Relax, relax, Dad! It's broken! It's broken! Ah, uh, you're gonna enjoy it at home. We've got a good old place for you. Oh, no, goats. I don't know what happened to Melon. He's wearing a suit. He's being really mad. And he's weirdly strict. Now get in the teleporter right now! Okay! Welcome, son, to your brand new house. You know what? Maybe this won't be so bad. This place looks beautiful. Now, come on in, boy. Enjoy it. There's tons of chores to do. Oh, no. This place, it's covered in cobwebs. No one's cleaned it for years. I should have known. Melon can't be responsible. First thing you can do, Sonny, is start by cleaning up this place. <sighs> As a grown adult, I don't have to clean. Dad, can, can, can I talk to Mom about this? I'm not so sure this is fair. Y you just adopted me. Shouldn't you take me out for ice cream or something so that we can bond over it? Do your chores! We have no mom. What happened to her? <laughs> she died in cleaning too too hard. Anyways, I, I don't really know, man. We just don't have a mom. I feel like she probably dumped you, huh? <laughs> she broke up with you for sure. I've never had anybody in my life except for Melody. Don't you bring that up. Get to cleaning. Fine, Dad. I'll take the vacuum cleaner and sword and I'll dust all these cobwebs. You better hurry up. Make it on the double, or there'll be dire punishment. All right, I'm vacuuming. Chill. Ah, oh, this place is so filthy. Oh, man, it's dusty everywhere. And what the heck's up with these planks? Oh, <gasps> secret room. I'll have to remember this location for later. A vacuum every block of carpet. Get under the tables. Ugh. And it looks like there's more cobwebs over here at the entrance. Clean up the main staircase. Ugh, there's even cobwebs on the ceiling. Finally, that's the last of it. Get rid of all this trash. The cleaning products back where they belong. Oh, you did a good job cleaning, Sonny. I'll give you some praise. One knuckle sandwich. <laughs> what the heck? That's so wrong! What, that's my praise. You don't want to see the punishment if you disappoint me doing one of my chores. Uh, Dad, uh, what, do you, what do you want me to do? All right, I'm getting pretty hungry. Why don't you make me some food while I watch some TV? Okay, but you're the parent. You're supposed to feed me. I swear, son, if you question my rule over this house one more time... Okay, okay, you don't have to threaten me. I won't question you. I'll just make you some food in the kitchen. Let's see here. We've got a stove top. I could probably bake a pizza there. I even have a chef uniform. Don't you dare touch my chef outfit. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> What do you want to eat? I'll make you something nice. Mm, you can make me up some vegetables, Sonny. I'm trying to be healthy after all. Okay, let's see what we've got. No vegetables there, but it's kind of interesting. You do have a watermelon smoothie. Is this what happened to mom? Uh, why is that in my fridge? What is this? Ah. Uh. Those dang people. Sonny, was this you? No, it wasn't me. I just moved in. I've never been here before. All right, that's your first strike. Don't make me count to three. Anyways, cook me up some vegetables, Sonny. I'm going to be judging your chopping form. What happens when you count to three? Yo, ma, ma. Oh, no. I was right. 
This is what he did to his girlfriend, Melanie. He's insane. Anyways, I just gotta find these vegetables and get chopping. <laughs> right? Right? Then you'll- then you'll be nice? Uh, it depends how you chop the vegetables, you know. Do you use the correct form, a 9 to 2 slicing technique? Uh, yeah, definitely. Get the knife and- How's my technique? How is it? Oh my goodness, that's awful! You need to chop them finer than this, even thinner. Okay, I'll do my best to julienne the peppers. Are these julienne? Oh my goodness, you are such a disappointment, son. E. How, how, how can I make this okay for you, papa? And why are you so weirdly strict? It's just slicing vegetables. It's not a big deal. Just make me a cake. You're such a disappointment. Well, I thought you wanted to be healthy. I just want something delicious. Okay, I think I can manage a cake. Let's see, all of the ingredients should be in here. We need eggs, we need sugar, and we need milk. And, and does a cake use wheat? I think it does. Yeah, that, that'll work. And then uh, I need a cooking crafting table. Yeah, because you obviously don't cook them like this. That would be crazy. You have to use a workbench. Thank goodness there's one in the dining room. And then to make the cake, yeah, you put three milk buckets up top. And then I, I put some eggs in the middle, some wheat, and some sugar for flavor. There it is! One cake! Excuse me, papa. I brought your cake. Would you like to eat it here in the TV room? Oh, yeah, that's good. Just, uh, you know, plate it for me, please. I don't eat off the floor like a... S oh! Savage. That's strike number two, Sonny. Go to your room! Oh, no! I really messed up! I thought he wanted the cake as soon as possible, so I dropped it on the ground! Ah! Uh, come to think of it, I don't even know where my room is! It's not that one. Maybe it's in here? Yeah, this looks like the kid's room. Two hours later. Melon, it's been hours! Can I please come out a timeout? No, Sonny! You're grounded till 6 a.m. That's oddly specific. Anyways, what if I make you some freshly baked cookies? Or do some more house chores? Then can I leave my room? Sonny, if I hear one more word out of your mouth, and if you're not sleeping in the next 30 seconds, you'll be permanently grounded. <laughs> Sleep tight. I'm gonna go watch some TV. Oh my gosh, goats. I think when the sun set and it became nighttime, then Melon got even crazier. He's my weird, strict, Dad! Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is very bad. I've got to find a way to get out of here before 6 a.m. I have a feeling he's gonna get more and more cursed as the night goes on. I gotta be really sneaky, though. He's watching TV downstairs. If he spots me or hears me, I'm gonna be killed! I gotta go around the long way, and I wanna find out what's up with this secret security room. There he is. Looks like he's watching Skibbity Toilets. Oh, I love Skibbity Toilets. They're so awesome. Okay, time for me to find out what's going on going on here. Let's see. Wait a second. That looks like Melon at the adoption center. Wait, he gets a new kid every day? And he forces them to do chores? And then at five in the morning, he pushes them into lava! Oh no. I've gotta find an escape plan. I don't have a lot of time. At least he's still watching his show. That should give me lots of time to figure out a plan. Whew, that's enough skibbity toilets for me. Time to check in on Sun E. Oh no. Guys, he's gonna go upstairs! I gotta go! I gotta go! That boy better be sleeping! Or else... <gasps> I got to bed just in time! <sighs> Alright, everything seems normal. <gasps> that was so scary! He snuck into my room to see if I was still asleep! This guy is crazy, he's so weird. And oh no, it's already 1 a.m. I'm running out of time. Okay, I need to sneak back downstairs to the kitchen. There's lots of eggs in the refrigerator. I can use those as a distraction when Melon's not watching TV. Let's see, there he is. Eggs, give me these. Yes, lots of eggs. And I'll keep this knife to protect myself. Okay, let me just test these out to make sure they work as a distraction. Huh, what was that? Chickens. Why are there chickens everywhere? Die! Guys, it looks like it worked. He's crazy and weirdly strict, so he had to kill the chickens to clean up his TV room. Come on, die! Why would this chicken die? I can use these to keep him distracted. There's more chickens. I can hear them. Oh, there's chickens everywhere. Die! Maybe there's a clue over here in the library. Come on. There's gotta be something I can use to get out of here. Oh, look at you little chickens. Look at you. Oh, it's 2 a.m. Let me check on Sonny. Oh, no! He's coming up! Upstairs! I gotta get back to bed. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Did you see a yellow man? 
I swear, Sonny! Oh, he's still asleep. Okay, everything's fine. That was way too close. Also, why don't I just unlock this door and leave off of the balcony? Dang it, it's locked! Wait a second, I've got another idea. Why don't I just break the windows? Are you kidding me? They're invulnerable to my punches! Uh, I'm gonna have to figure another way out. Come on. Uh, wait a second. Maybe if I turn up his TV volume really loud, it'll distract him. But I'm gonna have to be very, very sneaky. Unlock the chest, grab SpongeBob the movie soundtrack, <laughs> and put it in the jukebox. Oh, that is so loud and annoying. What is that sound? <laughs> I think it's working. He seems really upset. What is the sound? I swear, I'll kill whatever it is. Now that he's distracted, I'm gonna go back into his secret room and take a look around. There's gotta be something in his files. No way. He's got high-tech security equipment. Cameras, code breakers, monitors, goggles of true vision. He's got crazy stuff. I don't really think I want to mess with Blaze spawn eggs, though. <sighs> I think I'm pretty happy with this equipment. Let's install the security camera right here, and we'll track it on the monitor. That way, the next time he goes on his computer, I'll know that he's distracted. Let's see. I think another good spot for a camera is right up here. Oh, and I definitely want to spy on him to make sure he's watching his TV. And apart from that, one camera guarding the staircase should be plenty. Oh no, it's already 3 a.m. Time to check up on Sunny. He's leaving the TV room. This is bad. I gotta get back to sleep quickly. Oh, Sunny. Oh. He's just asleep, but it's really weird that he has a knife on him. Oh, well, probably nothing. That was very close. I guess I shouldn't hold this knife out. It kind of made me suspicious there. It's a lot better than if I was holding his camera monitor, though. That would have got me busted. Now, let's see. If I spy on the monitors, I should be able to find Melon and see what he's up to. Oh, he's just watching TV. Oh, let me check my computer room. I want to make sure all my escape traps are still working. Wait a second. He's going to his computer room, and he just said he wants to check on his escape traps. No. No way. This is how I can find my way out. Except his head is way too huge. I can't see anything. I'm gonna have to go investigate this in person. Goats, the only way I'll be able to pull this off is if I tase him. <laughs> oh, he totally deserves this. Boop. Checking on the escape plans. Hey, dad, I'm right here. Ah! Yes, it worked. And now I can spy on his computer. And he logged into his escape route. No way. Hey, there's a secret elevator leading to an escape plan underneath the house. Okay, this is perfect. I don't have long until he wakes up, though. Let me just put a lot of chickens in here. This will act as a perfect distraction and buy me extra time. Close the door. And where was it? Where was this secret elevator? It's around here somewhere. Come on, where is it? <gasps> Wait a second. It's probably in Dad's room. I bet you it's up here. I was right. The secret elevator should be located right down here. Oh, where did that guy go? Sonny! I gotta kill these chickens first, though. Die! 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 Let me check up on Dad. Make sure he's still distracted. Where is he? He's gotta be around here somewhere. <laughs> there he is! He's punching out the chickens! What am I doing? I have no time for this. I've gotta stop my son and murder him! I've gotta find a way out of here quickly. I wonder what this button does. <gasps> he dropped the sand! I'm out of here! Sonny, where do you think you're going? Uh, Papa, I was just making sure that your secret escape plans were still working! I gotta go! Ah! Get back here, Sunny! Oh no, I can't afford to make any mistakes! Get out of here, Blocks! I've gotta move! Sonny, I'm right behind you! I need this. Drop the concrete! Drop the concrete! Let's move! Oh, you can run, but you can't hide. Yeah, but I could totally row a boat. <laughs> I'm out of here! There's no escaping me, son! E! Yes, there is. I'm doing it right now. I'm literally making the getaway. I need to jump! What is going on? I'm stuck on my boat! Ah! Ah! My boat got sunk! Oh, this is good. This is good. What are you gonna do now, Dad? You're crazy and weirdly strict! And you're trapped in a pit. Trapped by my own design! You little rascal, you thought you could escape the weird, strict dad watermelon? Yeah, that, that is a lot. But here, have some chickens. These are a nice distraction for you, aren't they? It's been you the whole time. Ah! Ow! Ow! Dad! Dad! That's it. Tased! I think I bought myself just enough time, and I'm gonna surround him in eggs. That will really annoy him when he wakes up. 
<laughs> I'm out of Oh, wait, this is just a ladder that leads back to him. Oh, no. Oh, Sonny, you're so silly sometimes. You really think I wouldn't design an escape route to my own trap? Oh, no. You've literally got a key? <laughs> oh, Sonny. Dad, we can talk about this. Turn around, Sonny. What, what do you mean? It's just the water for the boat. <gasps> no! This is the lava trap I saw in the security tapes! <laughs> Die! Oh. And that's why you never mess with a weird, strict dad. And also like and subscribe. Goats, Quando organized this challenge called How Many Times Can You Die? But I can't seem to take damage from anything! <laughs> Guys, don't tell Sonny, but before this challenge started, I shot him with an immortality arrow. I'm on to you, Melon. You think you can win this game by cheating? <laughs> Make sure you go stick around to see who wins this challenge. Challenge. Yo, Sonny, last week I wrecked Quandale's try to die challenge, and I'm gonna get paid huge! Yeah, right, bro. Quandale, what's the deal with this challenge? So I created this arena where you must test your skills at dying. Whoever can die the most times the fastest will win 64 stacks of diamond blocks. No way! Stacks and stacks of diamond blocks? Melon, these are gonna be all mine! Uh, wait, Quandale, you promised me those blocks were mine already! No, no, there's still time for someone to beat your record melon dang it oh hold on it's really far sunny i'm gonna go get some snacks for the road Ooh, get me some popcorn and donuts i want a donut yeah yeah i'll get you that don't worry quandale while melon's grabbing his snacks can you give me any hints or clues no i'm all about a fair competition no cheating allowed uh fine i'll play by your rules okay goats here's the thing i'm not actually gonna get snacks instead i'm gonna grab myself my pickaxe and and some code breakers, and I'm gonna sabotage Sonny's challenge. He won't die even once. Come on, you two. I don't have all day. Yeah, Melon, hurry up, bro. Wait, hold on a second. I forgot. I need to say goodbye to Melanie. I'll be right back. Wait, what? Melanie doesn't even live that way. And why are you carrying a pickaxe? Oh, don't worry about it, Sonny. Uh... Uh, I'm taking the long way around. Whatever, bro. Just hurry up with my donuts. And now, goats, check this out. I'm behind Quandale's lab. It's time to break in. Because he has a specific item that I need. Just gotta go down into his top secret laboratory. And then bust in his top secret secure room. Boom. And check it out. The seeker bow. And the immortality arrow. If I could shoot Sonny with this, he won't be able to die and then i'll win the challenge and get rich and with this bow i literally can't miss <laughs> thank you quandale this was quite convenient just gotta go up and launch this arrow in his general direction it should hit sunny and goats i'll launch it from all the way back here hopefully this hits melon hurry up bro let's get the show on the road all right all right melon what are you doing you're driving uh never mind i'll just teleport there quandale why don't you teleport us too late bye dang it bro i can't believe i have to drive there this is so annoying road trip hey melon are we there yet no it's five hours away sunny hey Hey, what about my donuts? You have my donuts? Oh, yeah. By the way, we don't have any snacks at home. Why'd you turn this van into a submarine? What are you doing? Hold on. I know how to get there. Don't worry. It's fine. Oh, my goodness, bro. Where are we? We had to do some off-roading. Chill. One hour later. Are we there yet, Melon? Are we there yet? No, Sonny. We're not there, but... <sighs> Hold on, I gotta stop to take a little bit of a pee. Ooh, good idea. My bladder, it's about to burst. Hey, no looking, all right? Okay, no looking. But he didn't say anything about no shooting. Ow, what was that? Did I just get stung by a bee? Melai, let's get out of here. These bees are crazy. All right, let's dip, bro. Yes, we made it. Quandale, what's the first challenge? Okay, Sonny, in this first arena, there's only one way how to die. And no question about it. You'll figure this out. Let's go. Hey, Melon. Hey, Melon. Do you want to give me a hint? How'd you die on the first level? Bro, it's, uh, it's, it's pretty obvious, Sonny. What, bro? I don't see lava. I don't see anything dangerous. What, do I have to build up and just jump to my death? Bingo. You got it. In that case, it's time to harvest. Uh, Quandale, uh, how fast did I die on this level? Took you a while. About 10 minutes. Really? Yeah, you're really stupid. I had to tell you how to do it. Dang it. I think I need about 30 blocks to die from falling. 
fall damage. Th 30? Don't you think that's a little bit much? What do you think? It's 20, 22 blocks? 24 blocks? I don't remember how many. 30 blocks. That should be more than enough. Going up. Melon, I'm speed running this. The first challenge is easy. Oh, no. Sunny, you might actually beat me. Oh, yeah, bro. This is gonna be a speed run. But guys, it won't be a speed run because he can't die. He's immortal. But he doesn't know that. And cannonball! Wait, why am I floating so slow? What the heck? I took zero damage. Quandil, what's going on with your arena? I can't take fall damage. I don't know what happened there. Anyways, let's just move on. Are you kidding me, bro? This is so embarrassing. I was supposed to be speed running. <sighs> Whatever, let's just go to challenge two. Oh, Sonny, you failed the first one. I don't want to talk about it. <sighs> Quandil, what's the deal in this second arena? This arena has multiple ways to die. I'll give you a small hint. Collect some wood and create a pickaxe. The rest is up to you to figure out. Okay. Hey, I need to collect wood, craft a pickaxe, use that pickaxe. There's iron blocks! I know what to do, Melon! I know what to do! Oh, do you, Sonny? Yeah, I gotta make a cauldron and make potions and... Oh, wait, no, I'm just gonna make an anvil. Bro, what are you doing, Sonny? You better hurry up! This challenge probably took you five years. Okay, three logs should be enough. I'm gonna turn some into a crafting table, some into sticks, and I'm gonna use it to jump back up, make myself a wooden pickaxe, use this to get cobblestone. <gasps> There's gold under here? Bro, this arena is so awesome. You better hurry up, Sonny. Going as quickly as I can. I've already got a stone pickaxe. I need to mine up some of this for the anvil components. Oh, wait. I'm also gonna need a furnace. I gotta smelt these, which means I need more cobblestone. Melon, I am going to absolutely obliterate your time on this one. I am speed running. I already got the furnace. And guess what? It's already smelting. No freaking way. While that cooks, I'm gonna go grab these iron blocks. Yeah, you do that, Sonny. You do that. You're gonna need all of them. Yeah, bro. I'm making an anvil. And then I'm gonna squish... Melon! Melon, give me... Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, Sonny. I don't have anything. Melon, Melon, you're literally cheating right now. I don't wanna have to kill you, but I will. Okay, fine. Take the iron block. Thank you. Big man Melon's grandma. You look hungry, sweetie. Here's 420 kilograms of food. Bro, you... You are so chunky. Listen, man, my grandma feeds me good, all right? Okay, bro. I don't think you should eat that all at once, so that is a lot of food. And more importantly, I have enough ingots. I gotta craft my anvil, and there it is. Now all that's left to do is squash myself. I'll put the anvil up here, and I'll drop it as many times as I need to. Let's get goaded. And by that, I mean pancaked. What the heck happened to my anvil? Um, Sonny, your anvil has become iron ingots and disappeared. It just got shattered. What is my head made of? I forgot. My skull is so hard and, and hot. It's literally made of molten. Yeah, bro. You probably just melted the anvil because you're the sun. Looks like this challenge is going to be way too hard for you. Dang it. I got to come up with another solution. If the anvil is not going to work, maybe I can suffocate myself in gravel. It's actually pretty smart. I didn't even think about that. Oh yeah, this is ingenious, bro. It's going to take a little bit of time, but it's totally worth it. Then I need to find myself a little spot. Let's dig one out right here. Ooh, you just got rid of a gold block, Sonny. How does that feel? It's okay. There's a lot more. I'll get rid of two of them. Now, Melon, I need you to do me a solid here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I want you... Oh, I'm an idiot. One second. I want you to drop this gravel on my head. This is the only time I give you permission to try and kill me. Wait, really? Yep. Squash me in gravel. Okay. <sighs> no, no, no. Melon, you know what I meant. Uh, Sonny, I want to win these diamonds, bro. What's going on here? Why isn't this suffocating me? <laughs> Sonny, looks like your head's a little too hot even for gravel. What is going on? This is defying all the rules and nature of Minecraft. Quandale, there's something glitched with your arena. Nothing's killing me. The anvil shattered on my head and these gravel blocks are doing the same thing. Um, Sonny, I don't know what to tell you. You do realize that the point of these challenges is to die as quickly as
as possible? Anyways, let's just go to the next one. Dang it, Quandale. You're telling me I failed challenge one and two? Yeah, this is kind of pathetic. Ah! Sonny, you better not fail this one. <laughs> because if you do, you're definitely not gonna beat my record. Whatever, bro. Let me take a look around this arena. There's gotta be a way for me to die. <gasps> Water! This is gonna be easy. It's time to drown. I said drown? What the heck? Why can't I get down here? It keeps pulling me back up. I'm not even losing any bubbles. Uh, Sonny, what are you doing, bro? You're supposed to try and die, not try and float to the top. I'm trying. I don't know what's happening. There's this weird iron nugget on my head and it keeps pulling me to the surface. What is going on? This arena is cursed. Have you tried maybe putting a block above your head, silly? You know what, Melon? That's not a bad idea. Got a couple pieces of dirt and I'll put one right there and what the heck? Why can't I why can't I put them in the water? Bro, have you tried? Here, let me let me do it for you. Let me do it for you. Here you go, Sonny. No way. And Wait, what? My head just broke it. Sonny, you're such an idiot, bro. You're supposed to try and die. Stop breaking all the blocks with your stupid hot head. Bro, why can't I break this one with my head, but the one that's in the water that I need to drown, it keeps getting destroyed. Oh, Sonny, I, I think I know what's wrong. You're wearing a freaking helicopter hat and floaties. How did I not notice this before? Wait, bro, what happened? Before it was an iron nugget, now I've got these. I, 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 I am so confused. What is going on? Quandale's a arena feels like it's a bit of a prank. <laughs> Sonny, you are an idiot. Stop wearing those and take them off. Dude, I'm not wearing them. Look. Oh yeah, you don't have them on anymore. Bruh, you know what? I'm gonna find another way to die. I need to get myself a puffer fish. Let's see here. There's gotta be some secrets around here somewhere. All right, Sonny, I'm not gonna cap. I feel bad for you. Take this puffer fish. No way. This is exactly what I needed. Thank you, Melon. I'm gonna go right in this hole and place the puffer fish on myself. Duh! Not feeling it today. Sorry. I'm staying in the bucket. Bro! Bro! I need you to puff up and kill me! Sonny! <laughs> Even the puffer fish won't kill you! What is going on? I'm so confused! I gotta talk to Quandale. Something's not right here. Quandale Dingleberry! What's the deal, bro? Are you pranking me? Look at this! I can't even put a puffer fish on myself! No, Sonny! I didn't do anything! You're just really bad at dying, huh? Of course I'm not good at dying! I'm really Really good at Minecraft, but this is the one time I'm trying to die. Well, surely in the next arena, you will be able to die. If not, I don't know what to say. <sighs> All right, take me to the next challenge. If you can't die here, then I'm just out of words. Quandale, don't worry. I'll find a way. It looks like this is a desert temple on the surface. So if I break this, I should explode in the TNT trap. Yeah, but don't you want to check all the chests? Maybe there's other ways for you to die. Bro, there's no pressure plate here. <laughs> you idiot. You can't even explode yourself. Whatever, dude. There's arrows and cactus. Golden apple, I don't need that. Arrows. Yep, this is good. Oh! Ooh, spawn eggs. Maybe these monsters can kill me. What else? Uh, yep. Nothing here that I needs. Maybe I can make a bow and shoot myself. This can work. Give me this string. Now I just gotta build out of here and collect some sticks. There should be some dead shrubs for me to harvest. Or or wait, I could, I could just do this. Yep, that makes a lot more sense. And then I'm gonna make a crafting bench. Sonny, what are you up to? I'm about to do death by bow and arrow. Take a look at at this. I got the bow and I got the arrows. All I gotta do is shoot it up high and let it land back on my face. Is this actually gonna work? What just happened, Sonny? Bro, it's bouncing off of me. What is this? Bro, what is happening, Sonny? I've never seen this before. Uh, maybe I need more arrows. No, they're, they're just disappearing before they even touch you. Bro, I feel like I'm juggling arrows. Melon, you want to come stand under here? Nah, I'm good, bro. I'm good. It sounds pretty gross. Uh, okay. So that's not going to work. I'm so cursed. Maybe creeper eggs. Uh... <laughs> They just disappeared. Zombies? Yo, what the heck happened to the zombie? He's he's flying, Sonny. Something weird is going on. You're cursed or something. Skeletons? Bro, they're also just going flying. Okay, Sonny, maybe there's something wrong with your bow and arrow. Give it to me. Hold on, hold on. Let me let me the creepers all just died instantly. They just pooped out. Here, have some bow and arrow. Let's see. Here we go. And hey, it works for me, Sonny. No problem. What the heck's happening here? Give me that bow, man. 
back. Hold on, I want to catch the arrow. Ow! Drop the bow. Drop the bow. Give me that. And perfect shot. Where is it? Let me catch it. Let me catch it. What the heck, bro? It doesn't work for me. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, Dale. This guy literally cannot die. Wait, I know what to do. I got cactuses. I will build and run in. What just happened to that cactus? Are you seeing this? What is going on, Sonny? Bro, my body is compressing the cactus and it's not even prickling me. How are you even managing to do that? I have no idea what's happening. Have you ever seen something like this? No, I haven't, Sonny. This is so weird. What is wrong with me? Quandale, are you seeing this? Help! I think I know what's going on here. But anyways, let's go to the next arena. Dang it, another failure. All right, Sonny, surely you can die here. There's lava everywhere. Oh yeah, this looks easy. I'm out of here. Magma blocks. Nothing's burning me. Whatever, I need something even more hot than that. Like lava! Why am I seeing hearts? Why am I not dying? Melon, did you perhaps stumble upon a bow and arrow in my laboratory and shot Sonny? If you did, then that would count as cheating. And I would have to disqualify you. Uh, no, Quandale. I, I, I don't know what you're talking about. It must be that Sonny's bad at dying then. He probably subconsciously wants to be alive. Yeah, it's probably that, Quandale. Yeah, probably. Uh, if I can't die in the lava because I'm actually hotter than it, maybe there's something else I can use? This doesn't even make sense, bro. Normally in Minecraft, lava still cooks me even though I'm the sun. But today, nothing's going my way. Uh, let me try going to the real nether. Ooh, a chest. What do we have here? Here. End crystals? Oh, I can explode myself with those. And I have the materials to make a wither. Oh, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be good. Let me head back and flex this on Melon. Yo, bro, check this out. Yo, what's up, Sonny? I got some soul sand and wither skulls. This'll for sure kill me. Uh, Sonny, be careful, bro. I don't want to die. I'm going in creative. Quandale, if I don't die to this wither, nothing can hurt me. Wait, what? Boys, I'm gonna take the lead on this one. Heck nah, my turn today. Shut up, idiot. Why are they yelling at each other? Just kill me. Bro, the wither just quit. Bro, there's no way. Not even the wither wants to kill you. Bro, they just needed to attack me. That's it. Time for my final strategy. It's uh, it's gone, Sonny. Good job. Bro, you try. I don't believe this. This is Cap. You try. Sonny, it's really easy. All you got to do is place the end crystal down, get real close, and kaboingers! Dang it, bro. How does it work for you? Quandale, I've had it with this challenge. Nothing can kill me. Let me take you to the final arena. Arena. If this doesn't work, then something's fishy. Okay, Quandale. I'm willing to try it. Don't look at me like that, Quandale. Now for the last trial, I'll give you creative mode. You can set this command block to anything you want. If this can't kill you, nothing can. Ooh, thanks for creative. I got this. Let's see here. Slash kill. Big man Sunny. Done. All I need now is a button. And this better work, bro. If this doesn't kill me, nothing can. <laughs> Sunny, nice. What is going on? Why is it summoning pigs? This doesn't even make sense. Bro, it's literally set to kill Big Man Sunny. How is it summoning in pigs? Okay, that confirms it. You two, get over here. Uh, what's wrong, Quandale? Melon, I know you cheated. You shot Sonny with the immortality arrow. You are disqualified, and you will lose all of your diamonds. No! Well, Sonny, technically you didn't die, so I can't give you any diamonds. But, 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 but Quandale, this contest wasn't even fair. Well, as a consolation prize, I will do this for you. Okay, what are you gonna do? I shall ask the viewers to get goaded by liking and subscribing to the channel. Let's go, Press that subscribe button right now. Today in Minecraft, I'm gonna show you 27 of my best pranks ever. La 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 la. Oh, look, a trail of glistening melon slices. I wonder what's at the end. Oh, look at him. He's so dumb. If you guys comment, Sonny is the goat, I'll put a portal underneath him. Ah, oh, goats, I'm stuck in a jail and I'm surrounded by creepers and zombies. This is the worst. Subscribe right now or I'll be stuck here forever. And this is just the first prank. Stick around until the end for the crazy. 
craziest prank ever. Oh, yeah. This is so comfortable. The heat of this water, bro, just makes me feel so good. Sonny, as the sun, you're heating up this pool too much. It's making my melon rind way too hot. Oh. Yo, is your melon rind gonna melt? Yeah, bro, it's not very good. I prefer cooler climates. Anyway, Sonny, this was really boring. You wanna play some hide and seek? I was hoping you'd ask that. Dibs hiding first. Go count, bro. Give me my 100 seconds. All right, you got 120 seconds because that's two minutes. I'm going to go cool off in the ocean. Wait, Melon, Melon, Melon. Before this round starts, I want to ask you something. What? Do you think we can get to 5,000 likes on this video? Uh, no. I think we can get 6,000 likes on this video. No way. That'd be epic. All right, I'm going to go hide. See you, nerd. See you. <laughs> he admits he's a nerd. Okay, guys, I got to show you this. I built a special secret base before this video started, and it should be right right here. Climb down the ladder and check it out. I have a time freeze clock, sunny clothes, and wait, I forget what this one was. Don't worry, it's pretty awesome. Just gotta grab all of these, goggles of true vision, more sunny clones, and some invisibility potions. And last but not least, the triple bow, some arrows, and some sandy boy blocks. Also, I have these secret levers for later, so stick around until the end to see what happens. Now, Let's climb up and get to our hiding spot. And by that, I mean, let me splash myself with invisibility. And I'm gone. And now, I activate my sunny clones. Yeah, let's put one in the pool. Oh, look how beautiful he is. Look at this bedroom. Isn't it perfect? Well, you know what would be even better? A sunny clone. There he is. Ready for battle. Melon will open these up and get jump scared. Now, just in case Melon wants to check inside of the yacht, let's go in and let's put a secret sunny clone right here perfect close that door and i think it's time for me to actually go to my hiding spot here it is guys right inside of this bookshelf crawl on down and let's chill in here my secret dungeon okay melon i'm ready all right about time and guys i've got an axe with sunny's name on it <laughs> when i find you sunny I'm gonna drive this axe right between your sunglasses and break them. Yeah, as long as you don't hurt me. Wait, no, you can't break my sunglasses. They're invincible and really sentimental and important to me. Sonny, I literally found you in two seconds. You're such an idiot, bro. And you're walking towards your doom. Ow, stop hitting me. You're dead. No, no, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No, ah, ooh, ah I'm so scared. Wait, what? It gave me bones and it didn't say I killed you in chat. <laughs> Did you spot it? clones what the heck sonny yes you've fallen into my trap oh uh, what the heck why this is so annoying sonny how am i supposed to know which one's the real sonny by killing all of my clones okay guess i have no choice sonny hey sonny yeah you're never gonna find me bro my hiding spot's too goaded too cold actually too cold all right well i'll ask Ask my first question, are you inside or are you outside? I am inside, yes. It's quite nice here, actually. Okay, you say inside, which makes me believe you're not inside the house, but inside the yacht. I'm coming to find you, Sonny. Oh, I'm so rich and wealthy. Yes, the stacks. Sonny, where are you? If I were to answer that, it would defeat the whole purpose of this game called Hide and Seek. I know you're close, Sonny. I can smell you. Bro, there's no way I stink. I just bought new deodorant. Yeah, this smells really strong from behind this door. Hey, Sonny. Ow, ow, ow. No, it's another clone. That's right. You thought you were on to me, but I had backup. Sonny, how many clones do you have? Maybe like 4,000. Dude, there's no way you have 4,000 clones. Quit the cap. Quit the cap. All right. I have four clones. Maybe three. Is four clones including yourself? So like three clones plus you is four or four clones plus you is five? You're not supposed to be that smart, Melon. It's four including me. And that's your last question. You're out of hints. Dang it. Okay, where are you? I've just got to hunt down two other clones and potentially one real Sonny. Now, where are you hiding? Oh, 
Sunny, I've spotted another. Oh, it's not you. It's a clone again. Die, die. This clone was guarding something. Sunny, the bookshelf to a secret lair. It's time for my final plan. I'm gonna spam this room with Sunny clothes. When Melon gets down here, he'll be doomed. Oh, they're beautiful. Oh, no, Melon. Please don't come down here. I forgot to cover up the secret ladder. Ah, no. Yeah, Sunny, I heard a door open up. I know you're down here. It's over for you, son. What? What? Why are there so many? What the heck? No. It's over for you, Mr. Melon. Sonny, you dirty cheat. And in five, four, three, two, one, zero, that's time. I win this round of hide and seek. Darn you, Sonny. Okay, Melon, for round two, I'm just gonna start counting while I'm down here. You've got two minutes to find your hiding spot. Two minutes? That's more than enough time, huh? Now, since you cheated, I'm gonna play dirty too, Sonny. I wish you the best of luck with your cheats. I can see everything. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm sure you can, Sonny. I'm so scared. Where do I want to hide? Think of a goaded hiding spot. Okay, Sonny and I did agree to no ghost blocks this game. But since he decided to use clones, I don't think that matters. I've got the perfect place. Plan. If I can get right up there and convert those two bookshelves into ghost blocks, he'll never find me. Creative mode. Uh, yep. Uh, break, break. And now my secret layer has been constructed. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. I'm really happy for you, Melon, because you almost ran out of time, bro. You had 10 seconds left. And now I'm going to seek you out and destroy you. Yeah, sure. Okay, guys, all that I need to do, track down Melon, is go back to my secret location. Check this out. Inside of my top secret bunker, I have something special to show you. Never seen before. I've got a screen right here and a watermelon block that's linked up to Melon's brain. When I flick this lever, I'll be able to see whatever he sees. And activate. Oh, let's see. He's upstairs, maybe? Where is this place? It looks familiar. Uh, yeah, I see the staircase leading up. Yo, he's in the bookshelf! I can see the books. Oh, this is perfect. This is perfect. Let's go. Man, my spawn is crazy. No way Sonny's ever gonna find me. Okay, Melon, for my first question, are you upstairs or downstairs? I am, uh, staring upwards. You're staring upwards. Hmm. Gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe he's in here? Hello? Oh, wait. Melon, I found you. Look. <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't, Sonny. No, you didn't. You have no idea where I'm at. Oh, ha, ha, ha. I'm literally looking right at you. Very funny, Sonny. How'd you even get my head? Wait, you could see this? No, I mean, I can't see anything. What are you talking about? You literally looked right at it. Ooh, ooh. How are you flying? Yeah, you can see me. That means you're around here somewhere. Bro, no creative, you cheater. Oh, my bad. Sorry about that. Now, if I was a watermelon, where would I hide, guys? <laughs> Look at him. His arm is sticking out of the bookshelf. He's so stupid. Melon. Uh, second question for you. Are you, uh, hiding inside of a ghost block or something, even though that's against the rules? Uh, yeah. I knew it! I knew it! You're the one that made a bunch of clones. How is that not cheating? Because we never specified in the fine print if clones were illegal. Oh, God. Sonny, you're such a dirty cheat. Wait a second. What are you wearing on your head? This looks kind of fun. Uh, uh, these are called Googles of Teru Vision. Uh, so, um, uh, guys, I gotta go. I gotta go. He knows where I'm at. He knows where I'm at. I gotta get out of here. Uh, Sonny? Yeah? What do you want from me? Get out of there, you cheat. Ah! I win. Dang it. Why do you always have to cheat? And how are you always one step ahead of me? That is for me to know and you to find out when you watch this video later. <laughs> yes. That was awesome. The melon vision was perfect. Whatever, Sonny. You got two minutes to hide. Okay, guys. For this third hide and seek round, I'm going to use the time clock to freeze time on melon and troll him. So let's not actually even hide. Let's go somewhere out in the open to prank him. I'm thinking, yeah, up here on the yacht seems pretty good. Melon, I'm ready. You're already ready? That was way fast. Wait, Sonny. 
I literally can see you right now. I don't think you can, bro. That's not true. I just saw it. I, I can see your feet poking out right now. All I've got to do is come over there and touch you and it's game over. No way. No way. Activate time freeze. <laughs> and now he can't move or see me or do anything. Now I'll just run away and go somewhere else and troll him. Let's see. Up here looks pretty good. Yep. Up on top of the bushes and unfreeze. Wait, what the heck? Where did you go? Did you ender pearl out of here? Yeah, I ender pearled. You're right. Sonny, you scumbag. I'm getting over there right now. No more ender pearls. It's over for you. And time freeze. Yeah, over for who? <laughs> I'm gonna go on top of the second floor of the mansion now. And unfreeze. And with that, I'm gonna get you and it's a. Uh, what? What the heck? Sonny, how do you keep teleporting? Your ender pearls are so slick, I don't even see them. I know. I'm quick with it. That's it, Sonny. I'm coming for you. Wait, what are you holding in your hand? An ender pearl. It's a new one. It's called a yellow pearl. That looks like the time freeze clock, Sonny. Why are you holding a clock? <laughs> you figured it out, bro. I'm freezing time so that I can dodge you. Sonny, how am I supposed to catch you? That's not even fair. You're not supposed to catch me. I'm supposed to win because I'm the GOAT. I'm the best. I'm the best. I'm the best. <sighs> That's it. I'll get you, Sonny. One way or another. Oh, no. Melon, are you gonna try and kill me? Oh, I'm so scared. Oh, no. No, freeze. <laughs> yes. And now I'll activate my mimics. I gotta show you guys this. It's really cool. Put a bunch of chests around him. He's gonna be really confused and freaked out. Yes. Some over here as well. Oh, yes. And then I will just go onto the next balcony and and unfreeze. Sonny. Wait, wh why are there chests over here? Sonny, with your time freezing, it's so annoying. I put a lot of loot in those chests for you. You should check it out. Oh, to give me a fair chance. You're so nice. Wait, what? What the heck is that? What is that? <laughs> That was awesome. Dude, why are there evil monster chests that are trying to eat me? You should have looted it faster. There's actually items in it. That's it, guys. If I want to catch Sunny, I need a weapon of equal power. I'm heading to the ender pearl chest. Wait, what the heck? There's a god sword in here, too? This is perfect. All I've got to do is sneak up on him with some ender pearls and then destroy him. I actually have a chance, even if it's just 0.1%. I feel like Doctor Strange when he's calculating all the multiverses and in only one I succeed. I'm living in that one universe. Hey, Sonny. Hey, Melon. <laughs> you want to see some more mimics? You scumbag. Sonny, you'll rue the day. I promise you. You will rue the day in the next two seconds. Wait, what? How? Die! That makes no sense. How the heck did you get ender pearls? Let's go. I actually did it. Well, Sonny, you think you're the only one cheating? I actually made myself an ender pearl chest before this round started. Yeah, and what about that sword, bro? There's no way you just magically got the world's most powerful sword in Minecraft. I don't know, dude. It was just in the chest when I opened it, so... Ow! All right, Sonny, give me my two minutes. Your two-minute timer starts now. And get rid of that stupid time clock, Sonny. It's not fair. All right, I put it in the hot tub. No one can use it. Here we go. Guys, you know I'm a bit of a bookworm, right? But I'm gonna hide in the bookshelves once again. But I'm not gonna use a ghost block or anything that's detectable by the goggles of true vision. That dirty cheat thinks he can get me? No way! I will show him who the all cheat is. Bada boom. Now I'm practicing undetectable unless he goes on the mountain for some reason but let me just uh let me just patch that up and now i can't be found all right sonny i'm ready and i'm ready too when i find you melon i'm gonna turn you into a porcupine shish kebab what does that even mean it means i'm gonna put a lot of arrows into you and then i'm gonna stick you on a barbecue and cook you into roasted watermelon uh i kind of like shish kebab but don't roast watermelon that's not cool even though i've heard it tastes like ham i'm pretty sure it tastes delicious. Now then, if I was a melon, where the heck would I be hiding? Guys, it's okay. I don't need him to answer my questions because I have another secret trap. Gotta go down here, go down, and then show you guys what the secret emerald block lever does. Once I flick this, melon should be glowing. Let's see. It worked! There he is! <laughs> oh, this is good. He's gonna think he's hidden and he's got like some 
really cool spot. But I'm just gonna sneak up on him, shoot him with my bow, maybe. Ooh, actually, better idea, better idea. Let's go in creative mode and get some TNT. Whoa, so many options, guys. I don't even know what I should pick. Lightning? Let's start with that, because it won't destroy everything, but it'll certainly scare him. Sonny, you're not gonna find me. I'm gonna win this hide and seek, even though you cheated. I don't ever cheat, bro. I just use secret special techniques. Oh, this one sounds fun. The troll TNT. What, you don't like special techniques? I don't like special techniques when they explicitly break the rules. I don't remember there being a rule against no clones. Yeah, no time freezes. Sonny, you know what you're doing. You started a war that you cannot finish. You think so? <laughs> what are you doing? Nothing. Definitely not grabbing these items. I don't like this evil laugh. And now it's time for me to track you down. Melon, first question. Are you inside or outside? I'm, I'm inside. Melon, second question. Are you near uh, maybe like uh, kitchen tables or something like that? No, no. But why, why did I just hear TNT go off? Sonny, what are you doing? What is happening? Oh, oh, thunder, thunder. I hate thunder. I don't know, bro. I don't know. Uh, what the heck is that? Uh, what is what? Are you okay? Are you okay? Uh, Sonny? Why, why did the house just did it explode? I think it was probably the lightning storm, bro. It got crazy out there. I want to see what the spamming TNT does. It sounds really interesting. Yo, what? It's going to lag our whole game. What is this? Why is there dirt getting thrown everywhere? Okay, I had to get rid of that dirt, guys. It's going to lag our game too much. And now it's time for the finale of finales. Let's just see if Melon's in here. Oh, he thinks he's hidden, does he? He thinks he's safe, does he? And then I'm going to go like this and like this. What is happening? What the heck? Is that a... What, what did I just see? Melon, we got to evacuate the house. There's a storm. What is going on? Sunny, no, you found me. Yeah, I was going to say, by the way, I found you. Dang it. We got to get out of here. What have you done? What have you done? I didn't do anything, bro. Ah! Ah, it's doomsday. It's doomsday. Sonny, I have one heart. I have one. I'm dead. Wow. This was awesome. And you know what else is awesome? Pressing that like and subscribe button. Do it quick before our vacation house gets destroyed. Yo, Sonny, bro. How much netherite did you get? I only got two. You only got two ancient debris, bro? I got 17 and a bunch of gold. So I'll be able to smelt this down into netherite ingots. Bro, you got 17? Are you kidding me? Yeah, bro. Let's get home and cook it up. Sonny, let's get to smelting. And uh, could I maybe have some of that ancient debris? How much do you want, Melon? Um, look, I know you got a lot of it. So I just want to make like my tools into netherite, maybe. So how many tools do you have? Four. Bruh, that's almost all of my debris. I'll pay you back, dude. I promise. I just really want to get this full kit. Okay, okay. I'm a good friend. So you can have... Wait, there's none left for me if I give you this. You, you just have to get one more ancient debris. Then you can make a pickaxe. Okay, come on. Please, please, please. Melon. <sighs> Fine, bro. I'll let you have it this time. I'd probably go find some more in the nether quickly anyways, because I'm goaded like that. Yes, let's go! Finally, my netherite scraps are done. Hey, Sonny, do you think I could borrow some gold, maybe? You don't have gold? I let you borrow all my ancient debris to make netherite scraps, and now you need my gold, too! Yes, I'm sorry, bro, all right? You're lucky I'm feeling so nice and generous, and I know you're gonna make it up for me, my my birthday's coming up soon, and I expect a big cake. Yes, bro. I'll make it up to you. Can I have the rest of the gold, though? <sighs> That's all of it. I've got mm. none left. Yes. Time to make these ingots. Yes. Four netherite ingots. Let's go. And now... Come over to the smithing table, and I can upgrade my gear. Melon, I hope you appreciate that netherite. It cost me hours of my time and one whole diamond pick. This is all I have left now. Yo, you should, uh, you should break this cobblestone right there. Right here? Okay. Oh, see? You got plenty of use left in that diamond pick. Let me just patch that up and check out my tools. They're so beautiful. No way! You wasted netherite on a hoe? 
Bro, I need this tool. How am I going to make my patches? Check it out. Check it out. Whatever, bro. You did that so you could harvest melons? Yes, I did. And I don't regret it, Sonny. I'm so tired of you, Melon. Which is why I'm going to go take a nap upstairs. Wait, why is our room all red? How come there's nothing here for Sonny? Red carpets, red bed. I guess I have my yellow bed. But red banners? Dude, there's nothing good here. Maybe in my barrel I could spruce this up a bit. Let me get this and this. Yeah. Yeah, this is gonna look awesome. What did I just find? Uh, guys? Why is there a password protected chest here? Yo! What would the code be? One, two, three, four, five, six? No. Uh, 69? How about 69, 69? Yo, it worked! And what is this? Melon just made me give him my netherite scraps and my gold. But he had how much netherite? Two stacks of ingots and how much gold? One stack of gold and a stack of diamonds. This dude, look at him. He's working on his melon patches, but he left me what? He left me nothing. And he asked me to be kind and generous and give him all the resources I harvested. Meanwhile, he had this. I can't believe melon. I can't believe him. I'm changing these carpets too. Yeah, that looks better. That looks way better. And you know what? I'm even swapping his bed. That's right. No more red bed. And I'm putting yellow banners everywhere. It's sunny time. Actually, this kind of looks like ketchup and mustard. And then I put more yellow here to make myself feel better. But I'm still upset. I can't believe him. Hey, Melon. How are your melon patches going? They're going great, bro. I'm going to make this the biggest patch in the world. How many watermelons do you need, bro? I need about 4,500. That's crazy. And you needed to use my netherite to do this? Uh, yeah, I did. Actually, do you have any more netherite? I'm trying to make a shovel. It'll make this go a lot faster. You know what? Here's one more. Yo, thanks, son. You're the goat. Oh, I appreciate you for saying that, Melon. That's it, guys. I'm covering up his farm patch in yellow carpet and banners. That's what he gets. That's what he gets. And now, while he's fixing his farm, I'm gonna go talk to Quandale. Yo, Sonny, what did you do to my farm? What's wrong with you? I made it prettier. Bro, I'll remember this. I'm gonna get my revenge. Revenge for what, bro? I put banners down. It's fine. You went too far this time, Sonny. Melon, just calm post them. Okay, for those of you who don't know, Quandale is the best merchant in all of Minecraft. Look at him, Quandale Dingle. He's got that fancy monocle, and he's got the best trades in the world. So, Quandale, Melon's been trolling me again. He's had a secret chest full of netherite gold and diamonds, but he didn't tell me about it. Yeah? You've got something I can use to get my revenge? Okay, where is it? You'll tell me in exchange for one stack of netherite? Deal! Here you go. One stack of netherite. Oh, sorry I punched you and all. I know you're freaking out. <laughs> Yo, chill, Quandale. Just tell me where I can get the item I need. Yeah, it's in your barrels. Okay, I'll leave you alone. You are freaking out. The prank items have got to be around here somewhere. He said it's in his storage facility. Yo, I found it. Look at this. Floating island TNT, sand fireworks, hellfire. Bruh, there's so many epic super TNTs for me to prank Melon. I think I'll start with the floating TNT island. Oh, it's been a long day of planting melons. The patch is growing beautifully. I can't wait to see what it looks like tomorrow. Oh. What for now? I'm gonna go to sleep. Bro, what? Oh, this place is disgusting. Oh my god, it is gross up here. I'm gonna have to fix this in the morning. Yo, what's wrong? It looks good. You have some bread? No, it looks disgusting, Sonny. Whatever, bro. Just sleep it off. <laughs> Guys, I gotta get out of bed quick. Melon's snoring. He's sound asleep. <laughs> what 
is wrong with him? Whatever. I gotta grab my flint and steel, and I'm going into the basement. And then I activate the floating island TNT. This is gonna be perfect. When Melon wakes up, he's gonna be so confused. Look at it. Right above us is a giant island. Okay, now I just gotta go to sleep for real. Oh, he's disgusting. No, he's disgusting. Sonny, what the heck, bro? <sighs> good morning, Sonny. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? Yes, good morning, Melon. The sun is rising. The birds are chirping. It is just fantastic weather. Why is there a waterfall outside of our house? What is going on? Dude, that was always there, wasn't it? Bro, that was not... Hey, there's another one. Why is there a giant island above our base? What is happening? Wait... My melon patch. It won't get any sun like this. You don't need any sun on your melon patch. Bro, this is so ugly. What happened? Sonny, did you do this? I was sleeping, bro. You really think I could build this in one night? Bro, what's even up here? Dude, why is there... Ah! <laughs> Melon, what happened? I slipped and I fell. I don't want to talk about it. Okay, guys, before I use my next super TNT, I want to <laughs> troll Melon with fake water. I'm going to dump this off the top of this island down towards his melon patches. He's going to think it's just normal water, healthy for the growth of his farm, but then it's going to destroy him. No more. Maybe one over here. Yeah, this looks good. And now when he's dealing with that, I'm going to take the sand firework and put it inside of the house what is going on what is ow ow why is there poisonous water bro i gotta get rid of this melon it's destroying your crops no no i gotta go all the way up I gotta go all the way up and plug this water get rid of it dude the melon farm you need to bring it back to life quickly okay guys while he's busy doing that i put a sand firework <laughs> another sand firework and let's see what happens in that room wait what exploded melon you heard something bro i just heard an explosion i'm coming down in a second i gotta plug this water up though good idea good idea what is happening i think everything's fine dude i don't see anything wrong right now now. Dude, there's definitely explosions going on right now. Is there really? That's weird. I got rid of all the water. I'm coming down. What is happening? Dude, everything looks fine. I've just been watching your melons. <sighs> <sighs> oh, where is the normal water? Yo, normal water! What happened? There were some explosions. Is the house okay? Sonny, did you even check? <gasps> what the heck? Wait, what's going on in our house? Bro! There's sand everywhere in here. Dude, that is so weird. How does that happen? Sonny, did you bring the beach inside? What have you done? No, you must have been pranking me. What happened when you went onto the floating island? Bro, you not blame this on me. This was definitely you. Get back here. I'm gonna kill you for this, Sonny. Get back here. Wait, what? Kill me? I was watching over your melons. Yeah, good job. Look at them. They're all destroyed. Not all of them. See, look. This one's alive. This one's alive. Get back. Here. Leave me alone. You gotta tend to your field. I'm almost done cleaning up the sand. Oh, yes. All the sand is finally gone. Guys, Melon's been cleaning up the house for ages. Now I'm gonna ruin his day. Check this out. I'm gonna take Hellfire TNT and I'm gonna go like this and this just in case I need a little extra. And it's gonna be one, two, three, four, five, and a secret pressure plate right about. Wait, let me grab these blocks here. And then I just leave the house and start threatening his crops. Melon, I'm destroying your melon patch. What the heck, get back here. Get back here, sonny. Don't you dare. I will stop you. Wait, yeah, what was that sound? Wait, what is going on? What's going on? What have you done? What have you done? I'm on fire. I'm dying. Melon, our house. What happened? Oh, it's completely destroyed. What did you do? I didn't do anything. I was just breaking your watermelons. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Please tell me. 
Please tell me my chest is okay. Please, please tell me it's okay. It should be in there somewhere. It's gone. My chest is gone. What's wrong, dude? Don't want to talk about it, bro. I'm building my own house somewhere else. Okay, good luck with that. Yo, Melon, nice house. You rebuilt that pretty quick. Chill, stay away. This is my house. We're not sharing anymore. Why? What happened? Bro, you exploded the last house and put a giant floating island above it. I don't know how you did it, but you did it. Why do you always blame me, bro? It's probably something you did to annoy Quandale. Yo, stay out. I'm warning you. Stay out. Fine, chill. Like, seriously, you need to to chill out, Melon. Why? Why do I hear another TNT? What did you do? What is that? Oh my days. What have you done? Melon, chill out, bro. That's what I've done. Bro, I'm going to war. I'm going to war, Sonny. What do you mean? Just fix your house. Leave me out of this. Yeah, we'll get back here, Sonny. I'm full netherite. Cool down, bro. Dual wielding. I'm gonna get you. Yo, another TNT. What the heck? Melon, Melon, chill out. Come on, dude. It was just a prank. You're a dead man, Sonny. You're a dead man. Please, please. Wait, Melon. Melon, what's in this chest? This is so weird. Bro, wool TNT. What are you doing? What are you doing, Sonny? What, what am I doing? I don't know. I'm just trying to escape you because you're dangerous. You got dual-wielded netherite swords. Why are you running back? To my house because it's the only safe place i could think of what are you doing sonny what are you doing you better not detonate a tnt in there you better not detonate anything i'll let you go if you don't detonate any tnt sonny what do you mean i said deal you probably just blew that up with your own wool tnt no you're dead. You're dead, Sonny. My house is gone. You did that. You just found wool TNT and then you're framing me. What the heck's wrong with you? You're dead. You're dead. My house is gone. Melon, I'm sorry, bro. I thought it was funny. It was just meant to be a harmless prank. Well... It wasn't harmless, Sonny. I spent two hours rebuilding and you blew it all up. Can I make it up to you? I'll make you a new house. If you build me a new house, I'll forgive you. Okay, it's gonna be an island resort. You see right here? You're gonna have your very own tropical island. Check it out. What is that? I'm building it for you. Bro, you just exploded a house into existence. How are you doing this? You're welcome. Isn't she pretty? I mean, she's all right. She's like... Not even half the size of my other house, and it's also really tiny. Yeah, but look in the chest, dude. Yo, I forgive you, Sonny. Everything's okay. Let me take all that, though. Yes, my precious. My precious. And look, Melon. I'll even give you a place you can sleep at night nice and cozy. Oh, thank you so much, Sonny. And Melon, I was gonna try and fix your crops, but it's getting a little dangerous now. It's nighttime. All right, let's just go to sleep, Sonny, and get up in the morning. Good idea, good idea. Do you mind if I sleep outside of your home? Uh, yeah, you can dig a hole. Okay, thank you. Wait a second. How is he asleep so fast? I only had time to break three or four blocks. What is wrong with Melon? Those are not normal sound effects. I don't understand how he sleeps. That's it. What was that sound? What's going- What's going on? Why are there so many mobs? Melon, go back to sleep. You're just having a nightmare. Bro, how am I supposed to sleep in this environment? Do you see how many things are in here? There's two cows and iron. Bro, I'm not going to be able to sleep. I'm not going to be able to sleep. I don't know, bro. You were a louder snorer than any of these animals. Bro, what have you done? Melon, you've got to protect your diamonds, though. There's diamonds in your chest. I'm going to steal them. No, give me my diamonds. Give me my diamonds. Give me them, yes. Yes. Hey, what's that sound? <laughs> What the heck is that? Yes! What is going on? Get destroyed! Bro, I don't even know what's happening. Oh, let me out. Two hearts. Two hearts. Two hearts. And you're dead. <sighs> no. Okay, guys. It's been a few days since anything weird's happened. I lost my armor in that last shenanigans. So it's time for me to get myself some diamonds. And I found the perfect cave. Look at this. I see diamonds over there. Do you spot any more diamonds? I don't know. But there's got to be tons in here. Yes. 
Just gotta fend off some of these mobs. Water bucket clutch. I like the goat. Zombie, you ain't got. You ain't gonna do nothing, zombie. Yeah. Yo, guys, I've been tracking Melon down in this cave system. I think he's trying to get some diamonds. What is he doing? Yo, what is this? Yo, channel spider. Oh, I don't want him to see me. I gotta stay secret out here. I'm lurking in the shadows. Yo. Diamonds! Diamonds! I oh, no, there's a witch. No way. He's already got diamonds. Just be very sneaky. Give me these diamonds. I've got to get down here quick, guys. He's already found diamonds. I gotta sneak up on him. Two diamonds. Let's go. Come on. Oh, I don't want him to see me. I don't want him to see me. Oh, that was close. Okay, I'm sneaking up. Slowly but surely. I gotta get a little closer. He's collecting some gold. Whoa, what is this thing? Creeper! Creeper, no, you're gonna blow my cover! Gunpowder. Redstone. Give me that. Guys, I'm actually gonna sneak up on him. He missed this diamond too. Let me take that. Oh, yeah. So satisfying. Very nice. And then I'm gonna drop down right behind melon he's fighting creepers yo there's some diamonds here hold on let me get rid of this zombie yo watch this what is that what is that what's that sunny what are you doing <laughs> <laughs> hey, Melon! Yo, chill! I just thought you wanted to go to the end. Yo, relax, Sonny. Relax. I don't want to relax. I want to give you the Ender Dragon. No, there's... You're gonna erase... You're gonna erase the diamond. Stop! Yep, probably. <laughs> give me this. Give me this quick. Sonny, you made me lose my diamonds. Why would you do that? Chill, bro. I did it because I wanted to. I don't know what you mean, but I found more diamonds. Let's go. Yes. Yo, guys. <laughs> Melon's gonna try and get those diamonds, but he has no clue what's about to happen. Let me build up a little bit. I tried to warn him. I gave him a hint. I said, because. And now, I dropped the honey TNT, and I light it up oh boy the only two diamonds that's kind of lame what the heck sonny why would you do that you're Ooh. dead you're dead because i wanted revenge you stole all the netherite from me and you had a secret chest full of it get back here you scumbag yo where'd you go where'd you go hit me hit me you coward no oh god no no this is not good this is not good let me out let me out. The swarm! Please! Oh! Kill him, my bees! I can make it out of here. I can make it out of here. No! Good luck with that, Melon. Good luck. No! No! They're swarming! Let me out! There's only one way out, and it's in a body bag. Or should I say... A beady bag. Okay, Sonny, I'm really sorry. I shouldn't have done that. I just, I'm addicted to the netherite, man. I can't help myself. Take it back. Yeah, well, what do you have to say about the gold and the diamonds? Okay, I'm sorry, bro. I just love it too much. Melon, you have a problem. And all you have to do to fix it is share it with me. I want some of the loot too. I'm so sorry. Can you please forgive me? Yes, Melon, I forgive you. And can you also accept my apology? I'm sorry I trolled you so hard today. And to make it up to you, I've got x-ray TNT. It's gonna help you find all the diamonds. Yo, actually, let's go. You're forgiven, Sonny. Let's do this. If we work together, we can become overpowered in no time. And activate. Come on. Come on. Dude. Yo, there's diamonds here. Diamonds right over here. Oh, this is beautiful. And you know what else is beautiful? That like and subscribe button. Press it now. Today in Minecraft, I'm going to be pranking Melon for 100 days. Like the video right now to turn the floor into lava. Three, two, one. Ow. Subscribe right now to save me. Three, two. Two, one, thank you. Hey, that's not fair. Please. Yes, finally, we got diamonds, Melon. We finally got diamonds. Yo, let's go. You mean I found diamonds? No, Melon, 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 stop. Melon, stop. 
fuck it, fuck it, please. No! All right, sweet, I got diamonds, let's go. What is wrong with you, bro? Don't, dude, it's just a game, man, chill out. We just spent two hours looking for those diamonds. Bro, relax, we'll find some more, but for now, I'm rich, yes! Sure, bro, whatever you say. Sonny, no hard feelings, right? It was just a joke. Uh, sure, bro. Okay, I'm gonna go craft myself a diamond axe now. That's it, guys. I'm so finished with Melon's shenanigans. I'm gonna prank him for the next 100 days to get my revenge. If I'm gonna pull this off, I need to call the server admins. Yo, Quandale. Could you be a homie and give me creative mode? I really gotta prank Melon. <laughs> Let's go! Guys, it worked. I've got creative mode, and I saw Melon run out into the distance. So for this first prank here on day one of my revenge, I just need to come inside of the house and do a little bit of renovations. Yeah, that looks pretty good. And then let's go straight down. Oh, yes. He absolutely deserves this. Dig this pit a little bit deeper. That should work. And then we fill it up with lava buckets. Yeah. Yes, let the melon cook. And then I grab some ghost blocks like this. Cover it all up, cover it all up. Nothing suspicious to see here at all. Hey, melon, can you at least share one of those diamonds with me, bruh? Sonny, I literally just made a diamond axe. I'm sorry. Melon, can I borrow that axe, please? I want to harvest our sheep. Yeah, Sonny. What are you doing? Sonny, I'm harvesting them, bruh. You can borrow the axe in the face. <laughs> Come back here, Sonny. What the heck, dude? Come here. What the heck? No. No. Get trolled. Burn, Melon. Sonny, what have you done? We lost the diamond axe. What is wrong with you? There was no we in this. That was your diamond axe, and now it's gone. Now cook. Stop. Okay, so for day two of these pranks, I've got a great idea. I'm just going to destroy the bookshelves, implement a sentry turret, add a disguise module so Melon won't suspect a thing, and then I'm going to call him over for a nice fresh meal. Why don't I bake him a cake? Yes. <laughs> and I'll place it right there. Hey, Melon, do you smell that, bro? I just baked you a cake. That smells good, dude. I've been living off of raw beef since you murdered me. Yo, chill. Just come inside, dude. There's cake on the counter. What the heck? Why is there a turret? No, let me out. Let me out. No, I can, I can axe my way out of here. No, come on. Let me axe my way out of here. No, Sonny! Axe that! Nowhere to hide, bro. There's nowhere to hide. I, I can I can hide. I can hide. Yes, three hearts. What's your turret gonna do now? I don't know. You tell me. No! Let me out this door, please! Oh, oh, I just barely survived. Sonny, stop it. Stop it, Sonny! You barely what? You barely survived? Why are you trolling so hard? I can't even go in my own house anymore. It's day three of these pranks. And for this next one, I'm going to put Melon's head on. And then I'm going to taunt him over to the farm animals and leave him super confused. You'll see why. Melon, where are you, bro? I was just about to head in the ravine. Wait, Sonny, why are you wearing my head? <laughs> I thought it looked good. Don't you agree? No, it looks really bizarre. And also, what the heck is going on with the farm animals? They look so scuffed. What is this cow doing? He's at the disco, bro. He's breakdancing. Yo, he broke out. What the heck is happening? Why? What the... Wait, what What did you do to my fences? What do you mean? Your fences are still there. Why can't I walk straight through them? This makes no sense. No way, are your fences glitched? Are your fences all glitched? Dude, this is fine. The carpet's good. All the animals, they're escaping. What the heck, Sonny? That's our food. What did you do? What did you... Ghost blocks! Why, Sonny? Why? This is your food, not mine. I only eat carrots and watermelon. Get back here, Sonny. I swear I'm gonna kill you. Ow, 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 ow. 
I'm out. I'm out of here. Half a heart. Let's go. It's day four of my pranks, and I've got Melanie out in the open now. Melon won't be able to resist asking her out on a date. The only thing is, there's some TNT located underneath, and all that's left to do is take a nice button and a little sign and write a convincing message. Press button for a date with Melanie. And now I just wait in the shadows. I just gotta hide right here, and sooner or later, Melon will notice. Oh, just came out of the caves, got myself full iron armor, I'm geared up, looking fine, and wait, is that Melanie? Yo, she looks so beautiful. Press button for a date with Melanie. Oh, what a time to be alive. Let's go on a... Wait, what was that sound? No! <laughs> Yo, it worked. It worked. All my gear, it's gone. But even worse, Melody, she's completely gone. There's nothing left. How'd you like your hot date? Sonny, what's wrong with you? That better not have been the real Melody. I swear, Sonny. It's day five of pranks, and I've got something explosive up my sleeve. Take a look at these. If I type the word mine, there's these explosives for every ore in the game. Let me take some iron and some coal, because Melon just lost all of his armor. He's probably going to need some fresh resources soon, so let's just... Spice these up a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh, yeah, that looks pretty good. Some more coal here. A little more iron over here. It's too juicy. He won't be able to resist it. And a couple extra pieces of coal like that. All that's left to do is grab a couple of ghost blocks so I can have a secret hiding spot right up here should do. And now if I go in here, I could see everything and no one will know I'm here. Guys, I need to get my armor back. I can enter this cave. Where's the iron? Ooh, iron. Give me this iron right here. Come on. Stay away, zombies. Give me this iron ski. Yes. There was only one iron, though. Are you kidding me? Okay. There's more iron over here and tons of coal. Yo, mine up the iron first. Give me this. Oh, what the heck? It actually worked, guys. Why did that iron explode? <gasps> Was this Sunny again? Was this freaking Sunny? Melon, there's a really weird creature in this mine shaft. I don't understand. It's like a slime player. What is this? Sonny, why are you down here? Why do I see your name tag? I'm just keeping an eye on things. Look, he's after you, bro. Look at that guy. Wait, what the heck? Why is he so quick, too? Ow! I didn't even touch an ore that time. That slime guy's up to no good, dude. Guys, it's day six of pranks. I'm gonna do something crazy. I need world edit for this. Check this out. I'm replacing water with fake water. It's gonna make it so deadly near here. And then I am going to construct a diving board. Melon loves to swim, so he won't be able to resist this. Perfect. And then a way up. That looks perfect. And now to pull this prank off, all I gotta do is hit undo, and that's all safe water for me to dive in, and then I'll add the fake water back when it's Melon's turn. Yo, bro, where are you? I got something cool to show you. Dude, I was taking a nap. What's up? I built something epic. You know how you love to swim? Yeah. I made... The tallest diving board. Sonny, is this a prank? If I touch this diving board, am I going to explode? No, I'm on it right now. And I'm in survival mode, so everything's normal. Okay. Uh. Here, you can even push me in. Ready? Go. Yes. Epic. That was goaded. Okay, so this isn't fake water. You didn't take any damage. Let's go. It's all normal. What the heck? It's fake water. You lied. <laughs> the oh, oh, no. I slipped in. Yo, guys, I want to hike up this mountain and grab these pumpkins. Dude, I think they'd be great decorations for our house. Let me up. Guys, I'm going to egg melon. <laughs> Sonny, what's wrong with you? Stop trolling. I'm trying to grab pumpkins and appreciate this view. How do you even have that many eggs? I have an army of chickens that poop them out every day. Bro, you is weird. Just let me grab these pumpkins in peace. Guys, I'm going to make melons so tiny. Yo, what the heck? What? What? Why can't I jump up these blocks? Why am I so small? No, what the heck? Sonny, what are you doing to me? 
Is this you? I don't even know what that is. I'm just throwing eggs. Bro, I can't even make it. I can't jump anymore. I can't go up these. Bro, why? This is so toxic. Time to make him even tinier. What the heck? Bro, I'm like one pixel now. I'm literally the size of a pixel. What the heck did you do? Melly, where'd you go? I can't even see you. Sonny, that's it. <sighs> Stay away from me. Stay away. Is that you? I don't know what you're talking about. I just hear a little squeaky voice. I can't even see you. Melon, what happened, dude? You did something. You've been trolling so hard recently. It's annoying, bro. At least you're so small. You could go in these little caves I'm making. Hey, chill. Yo, I just sent you flying, bro. I'm still strong. Ow. Ow. Yeah, very strong. Sonny, that's it. I'm not leaving the house for the day. You troll way too hard. What the heck? Why is the front door blocked with cobblestone still? Why? It's because you were getting shot up by a sentry turret. I'm getting rid of this cobble. You're so troll. Guys, while Melon's destroying that, I'm going to set his scale to be enormous. Scale set. Let's do like a five. Big man Melon. What? What's going on? Why can't I move? Why can't I walk right now? Yo, I'm crawling. I'm gigantic. What is happening? Melon, why are you taking up half the house? House. Bro, why am I crawling right now? And why am I so huge? Guys, I'm gonna make him even bigger. What did you do? Sonny, why am I burning? Why do I see just wood? No, no. What have you done? What have you done, Sonny? You're bigger than our house! What the heck? I'm dying! Oh my god, Sonny, I can't see anything. What have you done? You look so stupid. Hold on, let me help. Let me help. Oh, okay, Melon. Here, this should help. I'm alive? Oh, I'm dead. Are you kidding me? Melon, we just found a pillager outpost. Let's go. I hope they have some crazy potion in there. Dude, they better have loot. Yo, check out what's captured. They have a laze in here. Bro, we gotta set them free. Yo, kill this boy. Get out of here. You are very mean, sir. Oh no, oh no. They flanked us, Sonny. They flanked us. What the heck? How'd they get behind us? Kill them. Kill them. We must destroy all of them. Melon, you move in. I'll go around the far side. I'm gonna free the Alays. Be free. Okay, guys. While Melon's trying to free those Alays, I'm gonna give him the craziest potion effect. Effect. Give big man melon bad omen. But look at this. It's gonna be forever. <laughs> He's so done for. Yo, I got a goat horn, dark oak. This is trash, bro. Where's the goaded potion? At least I can do this. Yo, did you hear their horn? Or is that you? I've sounded the horn. We've conquered the outpost. Let's go. You set the allays free, right? Yeah. Nice, dude. That's absolutely goated. Now let's just go head home quickly. Sonny, we made it home. Let's put the goat horn on display. One last blow. Yo, that thing is so cool. We gotta show it off for all our friends. Put an item frame or something. I got you, Sonny. Okay, guys. While Melon is setting up the goat Goat horn display. I'm heading downstairs, swapping to creative mode, and I'm gonna grab a villager spawn egg. Because if you remember, he's currently got bad omen forever. But if I put some villagers here and give them a nice roll, it looks like a raid is starting up. Yo, why is there a raid happening? What the heck? Melon, it's because you blew that goat horn. No way. That's it. To war, Sonny. Dude, where are they coming from? They're everywhere. This makes no sense. We'd have to have a villager for a raid to start. And, and I didn't even have bad omen. What the heck is going on? Are you sure, bro? You were blasting that goat horn like it was nothing. True. Maybe I got at that villager outpost. I completely forgot. There's just one more raider. There's just one more raider. Where is this man? Guys, while Melon's looking for the last raider, I'm gonna grab a sharpness 1000 stick and smack him in the back of the head when the pillager attacks him. Bro, I don't know where this pillager's at. We've gotta keep an eye out. Otherwise, this raid is never gonna end. Guys, I just need to splash myself with invisibility. And perfect. Yo, Sonny, I found him! Oh, there's a lot of mobs down here. He's in the cave! He's in the cave! These stupid clones! Why are there so many of them? What is happening? Yo, why is there a little baby? Oh my god, Sonny, I need help! I need backup! I need backup! I don't even know where you went! Bro, 
This is not good. This is not good. Help me! I'm in the cave! There's a lot of caves, Melon. I don't know what that means. I gotta clear out these mobs. Bro! Sonny, I'm gonna kill him! I'm gonna kill him! Dude, get him! Get him! What? He just one-shot me! Wait a second. Slain by big man Sonny. What the heck, Sonny? How did you kill me instantly? I don't know what you're talking about. It's probably because I punched you on accident earlier. What the heck have you done? Sonny... We finally defeated the raid. It's been a long day, though. I can't wait to go to sleep. It sure has, dude. I'm gonna put this banner here so pillagers know not to mess with us anymore. Dang straight. Oh, I deserve this rest. Oh, how you feeling, Gort? Yeah, I feel sleepy, too. Wait, that's why we got raided. You had Gort upstairs. Bruh, you know what? Gort's chill like that, all right? And now he's taking your bed, so you're stealing my bed. What, I gotta go sleep here in the bathroom? Dang it. Okay, guys, this is actually perfect. While Melon thinks I'm trying to sleep, I'm actually gonna pull off the <laughs> ultimate prank. I just gotta grab a little bit of world at it. Copy one location there. Fly up to, like, say, here. Get the next position. Oh, this is gonna be too funny. Copy it. And then there should be a ruined nether portal over here. There is. I'm going to the nether. And I'm bringing the house with me. Check this out out it's beautiful Ooh, wait what's going on bro why is it so hot in here and why are there red particles everywhere what the heck i'm gonna check out the window what the heck why am i in the nether what is going on melon melon it's so hot it's so hot why why are we out here i'm so confused what is going on we're stranded out here i think we can at least make the most of it get in the lava no why Hi, Sonny! No! Hey, I'm back in the normal world. And the house is okay. Wait, that's perfect. Let's go. Maybe it was just all a bad dream. Okay, goats, we just got back from the nether. Melon thinks he was having a nightmare that it was all just a bad dream. So let's make it extra spicy. Oh, yes. I'm creating a Wander Melon army that will destroy Big Man Melon. I need more. More reinforcements. More clones. I'm even going to put some inside of the house. <laughs> oh, yes, this is is brilliant good morning melon good morning melon good good morning melon good morning why are there so many melons here what are you doing sonny what is go what the heck is happening i thought what the bro i thought the nether was a nightmare this is even worse wait maybe i'm still sleeping please wake up please wake up why are there so many melons no this is not good this is not good no, let me out of the corner, please. No, I'm gonna die. Wait a second. Big Man Melon was slain by Big Man Melon. Dude, are you okay? Bro, there's so many. What the heck? Is this isn't a nightmare. This is real life. Dude, you're not sleeping. I'm right here. Bro, get rid of these melons. Oh. Thank you. They're all gone. No, there are more outside. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Please. Sonny, what are you doing? Let me in. Close the door and we'll pretend like nothing's going on. Okay, I'm just going to go back to sleep. So why are they inside? Bruh. It's now day 35 and I'm going to pull off the most extravagant prank so far. Check this out. I just need to paste something in. It's a little FedEx truck because Melon's got some nice deliveries on the way. All I need to do is change my skin and perfect. I'm now a FedEx delivery driver. Now, as a FedEx driver, all I've got to do is distract Melon with a password protected chest 6969. 69 he'd never guess that one and there's nothing inside of it but what there is gonna be is me the fedex driver with a say goodbye tnt blasting him now all i've got to do is alert melon by honking the horn wait bro is the fedex guy here finally yo he is where are my packages? Yo, what's up, Mr. Dude? Is it okay if I go grab my package real quick? Yes, Mr. Melon. Your FedEx delivery is in the back of the truck. All right, man. Thank you. That guy sounds a little goofy, but I don't want to tell that to his face. All right. Wait, what the heck? Why is there a password protected chest? What's the password? Mr. Melon, you set the password yourself. Oh, yes, I forgot. I am just the driver. I don't choose the password. One, two, three, four. What is it? I don't understand. What the? No! <laughs> Yo, Melon, 
Get pranked, bro. No way. You're the FedEx guy? What the heck? Why? I lost all my stuff. Why, yes, Mr. Melon, I am the FedEx guy. Get destroyed. That's it, Sonny. Get back here. You're dead. You're dead. No, I'm the goat at parkour. You'll never catch me. I'm out of here. Why are you so quick? Sonny, why would you do that? You destroyed half of our house. Now I've got to repair the house. Because Sonny's a big idiot and used a giant TNT to troll me. <laughs> this guy. Mel has been working on repairing this house for days, guys. Now it's time for me to do something really goofy. Check this out. I go up really high. And then it's like, boom! Creeper bombs! Why are there but Yo! Why are there creepers? No! Not the house I was fixing! No, get out of here. Get out of here. What is happening? Oh, at least I'm safe in this open area. Nothing can hurt me here. <laughs> A hundred of them. What the heck? Yo, yo, how did I survive? I'm actually the goat. Guys, Melon thinks he's powerful. What happens if a hundred Ravagers entered his server? What the heck? That was really quick. He died so fast. Bro, there's no way I'm going to get my loot back. How am I ever going to defeat these Ravagers? At least they can't get me up here. Melon thinks he's safe in here. I'm thinking a hundred husks should do the trick. What the heck? Okay, guys, I'm in an infinite death loop. This is not fun. This is not fun. Uh, I'm just going to disconnect. I rejoined and all of them are gone. Yes, I'm a genius. I am so smart. Guys, it's been 10 days since my last prank and I just saw this chest in our house. Melon's chest. Do not touch Sonny. He's really angry with me, as you can see. And what's in here? Three diamonds? You're right. I won't touch that chest. I don't need to. Instead, I'm going to carve out another secret area. Right around here should be pretty good. And I'm going to get myself some item hoppers and my own super duper secret chest. And now all I have to do is install these hoppers to steal his loot. And it's going to end all the way over here at my top secret password protected chest because I don't want Melon stealing my stuff. And then I just got to go like this and this all the way over. Just got to go a little further and perfect. That loot is all mine. Cover it up so he doesn't notice. And there's nothing suspicious here at all. And all that's left to do is set up a secret entrance. Open this up and install some ladders. Now Melon will never know I'm here. One, two, three, four. And I stole his three diamonds. All I've got to do now is wait for him to deposit more loot. Yo, guys, I just had a big trip in the mines and I got 16 diamonds. Let's go. Now I just got to deposit them into my chest here. Oh, that's not the door. All right. Don't tell me there's still ghost blocks here. Okay, good. He got rid of them. Uh, why is there a creeper? Are you kidding me? Well, at least they gave me a shortcut. Guys, I really hope that didn't blow up any of my secret blocks. No, I enter my very own private chest and deposit the... Wait, why are they draining? What's going on? Why are they draining? I can't take them out. What's happening? No! Bro, what just happened? What just happened? Guys... Melon's freaking out. Let's see if it's working. Come on. Yo, 19 diamonds and a chest. Dude, what the heck? Why is there a hopper below my chest? There's another hopper. Why? What is going on? Bro, what the actual heck? Password protected chest. Bruh, give me this. What's, what's the password? 69? Sonny, you scumbag. Yo, I got in. My diamonds aren't even there. Guys, I got the loot. I got the loot. I'm bringing it back to my secret barrel. He'll never find them. Are you kidding me, Sonny? What have you done? Look, Melon, I just found this random chest. Sonny, you scumbag. You took my diamonds, didn't you? Do you have any evidence of this, Melon? Oh, uh, there's a secret chest. And does it have my name anywhere or fingerprints or something? Thing. Sonny, I know it was you. I'll remember this. Innocent until proven guilty. All right, guys, time to chef up. Give me this. Cook up this gold. Cook up this iron. I also need to cook up some steak somewhere. Let me craft another furnace real quick. Uh, Melon, just giving you a warning. There's some strange traveler about to attack you in your house. What do you mean? This slime dude. Nah, that's my homie. He's real chill. What's up, mister? Yo, chill. What are you doing? No, he's got an iron sword. Bro, chill! 
Chill. I don't think he's chill, bro. I thought he was cool. He's like, there's only room for one green character in this server. Yeah, that's it. He's stuck in a hole, though, now. You're dead, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> nice try. Okay, guys, while Melon's distracted, I'm gonna run a crazy command. Rotate 0, 180, 0. And now I flipped our house upside down. And I can paste it in somewhere else. Maybe right about here. And paste. Oh, uh, what the heck just happened? Dude, our house is flipped upside down. What did you do? Sonny, what did you do? What the heck? Bro, how am I supposed to get down from here? Dude, I am so scared. I don't understand what happened. Melon, what have you done? What have you done? Eat this. What have you done, bro? Nothing! You just tried to anvil me, you scumbag. Oh, dude, the basement is now the upstairs. This is so weird. I kind of like it, bro. This might be an improvement. I don't know, man. The basement's pretty goofy right now. Sonny, I've got to escape. There's only one way down. Melon? Be careful, bro. Be careful. Wait, I got to get up top first. This is so weird. How do I get to the basement? You have to climb backwards. Oh, I found it. I'm so confused. And then I go up the stairs and look. Oh, there's the stairs. Then, so, ah, this is so annoying. Melon, the stairs are right here, dude. It's not this hard. Let me go to the edge. Wrong it. Sonny, you scumbag. No. Ha. <laughs> You got absolutely flattened. And then I survived the fall like a goat. Ow, that's fake water. Sonny, I'll be right back. I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> really bad right now. Yo, what, you gotta poop or something? No comment. Uh, guys, I actually think Melon just went AFK, which is kind of perfect. I've got an idea. I just gotta dig out all these blocks from around him and construct something devious. I'm gonna need to be quick. The only thing I need to do that's kind of tricky is I gotta swap Swap this block to slime. Now I could finish working on the ultimate rocket ship machine and launch him into outer space. Then I just got to make a little bit more room here. Check this out. This is going to be such a good prank. And then a little bit more slime right here. And then look at my design. I just need two pistons and some redstone. This is super easy. Just need a sticky piston down like that and a normal piston up here like that. Make sure it's not touching anything because then it would go horribly wrong and pretty much all i gotta do is take this redstone block and place it right here then the rocket ship will lift off yeah mom no i'm playing minecraft yo guys mel is yelling at our mom and now lift off yo it's working it's actually working it's even carrying this extra block that i didn't break all right i'm back what's going on sunny what have you done what have you done why and how? I thought you'd appreciate the ride, bro. You're going to outer space. Sonny, you scumbag. I'll make it out of this alive. It's okay. I can do this. Why would you want to get off the rocket ship? You're literally going into space. You're right, Sonny. But how long will this go on for? Dude, it's going to keep going until you get to the moon. Yo, I'll see you guys on the moon. That's it. I think I can make it to the water. Let's go. Please. Wait, how am I? What? How did I not make it to the water? That was not even close. Bro, I was so high up. I thought for sure I'd make it. Why is there a random guy here? Ow, chill. Guys, it's almost been 100 Minecraft days of pranking my friend Melon. There's just one or two things left that I want to do to him. I've transformed into Spooderman. That's right, Spooderman is back in action and ready to destroy Melon. Now I just need a bunch of cobwebs and spider eggs. Wait, what's that sound? Uh, why are there cobwebs? webs outside it's your friendly neighborhood spooderman what the heck where are you spider-man what are you doing to my house i'm just improving the design wait sonny is that you you sound a whole lot like the FedEx guy. I don't know about any FedEx people, but I am Spooderman. Stop spotting spiders in the house. You're so annoying, Sonny. What do you mean, Sonny? How did you know it was me? Because you have one other voice and you sound exactly like the FedEx guy. What do you mean? The FedEx guy sounds like this. Um, Spooderman sounds like this. Makes no sense. No, I can't even run from these spiders. They can climb things. 
<laughs> I gotta go in the poisonous water. Please, I can make it out. No, it does so much damage. And the hero saved the day. Sonny, what did you do? Why is the whole house TNT? If you remember, Melon, 100 days ago, you pushed me in lava and ruined my dreams of finding diamonds. Yo, chill, chill. Wait, Sonny, that's what all this pranking for the past 100 days has been about? Three diamonds? It wasn't even that big of a deal. Yes, it was to me. And now I'm destroying everything we care about. No, let me out. Make sure you like and subscribe. Today in Minecraft, I secretly cloned Melon to prank him. Yo, Sonny, I just got back from the store. Sonny? Uh, what the heck? Who is that? And why does he look like me? <laughs> like the video right now to make Melon's clones attack him. Ah, help. Quickly, goats, subscribe right now to save me. Yo, Melon, I'm really hungry for some birthday cake. You think we have the ingredients in the fridge? Uh, yeah, probably. Hmm, this fire's awesome. Wait, what the heck? We only have one milk bucket. Uh, I'll have to go get the rest. All right, yeah, you do that. You do that. I'm just gonna sit back, kick back, and relax. Oh, this feels good. Okay, so I think for a cake, I need three milk buckets, three pieces of wheat, some egg, and sugar. I should have some more cows in here. Just gotta grab the milk buckets from up here and get these cows juice and that's three milk buckets checked off the ingredients list now i need a little egg you chickens don't mind if i steal your babies let's go let's go all right i got the egg that's checked off the list just need some sugar now hey fresh sugar cane this cake is gonna be delicious and then i just turn that into sugar and now i just head back home and bake this cake uh. Feels so good to be near the fire. Uh, are you okay, Melon? What are you doing? Uh, nothing, nothing. I'm just looking at the fire, chilling. Yo, you are weird, bro. I'm gonna bake a cake. Just gonna put the wheat. I'll put that egg, that sugar, and then milk buckets. Yeah! I got a cake, Melon. Check it out. Whoa, you baked us a cake, but I feel like we need more than one cake, you know, Sonny? Uh, first of all, I baked myself a cake. <laughs> and if you want one, Maybe I could go buy one from Quandale, okay? I'll be right back. Yeah, get a bunch for, like, the rest of the week. Yeah. Yeah, good idea, good idea. He's probably got a lot of cakes on sale right now. Quandale! Hey, Quandale! I'm looking to buy some cakes, brother! I know you run a great shop. This bakery better have fresh cakes for me, Mr. Dingle. Uh, actually, Sonny, I don't have any right now. Wait, what do you mean you don't have any cakes? They're all sold out, but I can sell you this cloning device. A cloning device? That's actually epic. How much does it cost? It's usually two stacks, but I'll sell it to you for just one stack of diamonds. Bruh, I can't afford that. I just wanted birthday cake. Ugh, whatever. I guess I'll have to share it with Melon. Mmm, guys. Mmm, delicious cake. Give it to me! Oh, that was delicious. I am full to the brim. I'm just gonna chill on my couch. Melon! Yo, what's up, Sonny? Oh, I'm full, bro. Uh, I got bad news. Quandale doesn't have any cake for sale today. He's all out. Ooh, that is really bad news, Sonny. I was thinking you would just get the cake and then you'd have a cake for yourself. It's okay, bro. The good news is I'm feeling generous today. We can share the cake. Um, about that cake? Uh, wait. Where's my cake? Melon! I thought you were gonna buy some more cakes and things were gonna be all right. And, uh, anyways, I'm pretty stuffed. I'm gonna go take a nap. I'm in a little bit of a food coma. Did you eat the whole thing? Yeah, I did, bro. I thought you were getting your own cake. Calm down. I hate you. I worked so hard to make that cake and then you just ate the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, guys. I'm going downstairs in the mining area, and I'm grabbing our diamonds. Melon thinks he could just take my cake like that. There they are. Grab these diamonds, and I'm gonna go buy this cloning device from Quandale Dingle, and then we'll see who gets the last laugh. I can't believe this guy. I work so hard. I bake that cake. I gather the crops. I milk cows. I bake the cake, and then he eats it. He eats it. He didn't even leave me one single slice. Yeah, Quandale, I'm back. I'll take that cloning 
cloning device off your hands, please. Thank you, Sonny. The cloning device is in the password protected barrel to your right, and the passcode is just one, two, three. Let's go! One, two, three, buckle my shoe. Oh, there it is. Got the cloning device. Oh, yeah. The cloning device still isn't finished, so there's no calibration or anything, and it potentially might not even work. Just letting you know. Bruh! You should have told me that before I paid for it. Oh, that's cool. It'll still be pretty fun to prank Melon with this anyways. Just hop on by and I can update the firmware once I make a new one. Aw, thanks, Quandale. And now I take my cloning device and I head back home to get my revenge! Okay, guys. According to the cloning device, I'm gonna need to gather three items before I can make a Melon clone. I need a Melon slice, Melon's DNA, and Melon juice. It's actually gonna be pretty fun to collect these items. Hey, Melon! <laughs> How's your nap going? Mm, pretty good. Uh, I think I'm gonna walk it off now. Oh, ooh, that's a lot of cake in my stomach. I ain't gonna lie. I hate him. He ate my cake and now he's bragging about it. Whatever. I'm gonna grab this stone axe. I gotta go downstairs into the kitchen. There's a few other supplies I need to gather. Yep, one glass bottle to get the melon juice. And I should have some sweet berries here somewhere. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna use these to gather his DNA. Hey, Melon! Mm -hmm. What's up, Sonny? I, I got something I want to show you. Check this out. What? what? What is that, Sonny? It's a sweet berry bush. Just give it a little time. It'll grow up big and strong. And then you can enjoy some nice sweet berries. Okay, Sonny. Yo! The berries are ready, bro. Give them a try. Um, okay. Ow, 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 ow! What the heck, bro? This bush is not nice. <laughs> I'll gather these up and be on my way. Ah, uh, these will have a lot of melon DNA on them. What is wrong with Sonny? That was the weirdest interaction with him ever. I'm getting rid of this bush. Now, I've just got to remember where there's a melon. Oh, yeah! Quandale's always got some watermelons in his stash. I've just got to go. <laughs> Destroy one! Yes. It's time for you to be sacrificed. And now I've obtained the DNA and the melon slice. All that's left is a little bit of watermelon juice. Melon, where are are you? Are you inside? Yeah, I'm just chilling. Okay, I just gotta ask you something real quick. What up, Sonny? What's your favorite type of sandwich? Um, a knuckle sandwich. Yo, I figured as much. Boom! Ow! It worked! I mean, <laughs> yeah, high five, bro. That was awesome. What the heck was that for? Ow! I'm bleeding now a little bit. Juices are dripping. Okay, guys. I've got the melon juice. His DNA is on these sweet berries, and I've got melon slices. Oh, the left to do is combine them. Yes, it worked. Look at the cloning device. It's now locked on to Melon. Now I have the power. Check this out. Clone. Yo, it worked. But this clone kind of sucks. It feels outdated. Like he's not even moving around. Hello? Can you even hear me? Bruh, this clone sucks. I guess Quandale did warn me. That's fine. I'll just go along with it. Hey, Melon, come outside. Your twin brother's visiting. Oh, what do you want, Sonny, bro? You've just been punching me, stabbing me, and what the heck is that? I told you, your brother's visiting. He's from out of town. Wait, I have a brother? Oh, we shall call you Melon 2, because I'm Melon 1. No, actually, he's just big head Melon. Look, his head is way juicier than yours. No, 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 that's impossible, bro. How is his head bigger than mine? I have the biggest Melon of all time. Not anymore. Whatever, bro. I'm so excited. I can't wait to do all sorts of fun things with him, like uh, uh, play hide and seek, play hide and seek, play hide and seek. Wait, Melon, did you hear? He wants to give you a gift. I think you gotta get him something special too. Um, yeah, just give me a second. I'll I'll go get him something real nice. I'll be right back. Just 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 wait for me, big big head, Melon. Okay, guys. While Melon's trying to go find him a gift, I'm gonna have his brother, big man, big head, Melon number two, give him a glitch. Glycerine melon. Just gotta find it. It's around here somewhere. Ugh, it's gotta be one of these chests. I thought for sure. Oh, wait. Here it is. Grab this. And now I'll put it right in front of the clone. Yo, melon's gonna freak when he sees it. That's his favorite item in Minecraft. Yo, what's up, big dome melon? I figured we'd keep it light and casual. And I got you this poppy. Oh, wait, what? You got me a glistening melon? What the heck? 
Bro, these go for like two quadrillion billion diamonds. How the heck did you get me this? And I just met you. Why are you being so nice? Let's not exaggerate things. It's not that valuable. Besides, you've got hide and seek to play. So why don't you go find your hiding spot? Oh, I got this. I'm gonna hide in the most epic spot of all time. I'm going in the mines. Oh, guys, while Melon's going into his hiding spot, I've gotta move the clone quick. Otherwise, he might catch on that this isn't even a real person. Gotta just uh, pick him up. And I think right here's the perfect spot for the seeker. Just gotta clone him. Yo, that's perfect. Yo, check out this secret cave area. It's awesome. He's never gonna find me here. I'm ready whatever, brother Melon. Okay, goats. I just heard Melon say he's in his hiding spot. And the best part is I know exactly where he went. He's just underneath the Melon clone. Just gotta break this block right here. Uh, wait, what? How did you know? <laughs> It actually worked. Yo, that's awesome. Maybe Brother Melon does have the biggest melon. He found me like it was nothing. And he was drilled through the ceiling and found me. You're a genius. Do you have anything to say for yourself? Bro, this was such a boring hide and seek. Why don't we play a better game? Like, uh, hmm. Uh, stone, paper, shears? You mean rock, paper, scissors? Yeah, exactly, but the Minecraft version. Okay, how do we play that game, Sonny? Let me go set it up, and then you and your clone can one versus one. I mean, you and your brother can... Yeah, your brother can one versus one. Yeah, it's my brother, Sonny. You're making that weird, dude. We don't even look anything alike. We're not even twins. Sorry, my bad, my bad. And the game's ready. Which side do you want to be on? I'm gonna pick this side. I've got a good feeling about this side. Okay, the rules are simple, by the way. You get to pick an item out of your chest, you place it in the dispenser, and so will your brother, Big Head Melon. All right, this sounds awesome, bro, but where is he? Yeah, he's, uh, he's right behind you. Look over there. I don't see him. What are you talking about? Melon, look, he's right here. He's ready to play. What? He's not behind. How in the heck did you do that? You're my hero. You're incredibly awesome. Yeah, I'm gonna just let you guys play this one now. I I'm gonna go inside for a little bit. I'll show you that I'm the older Melon here and school you in a game of rock, paper, scissors. I like your red shirt, Melon. Guys, that means he's gonna go rock. I know it. He's gonna go rock. Guys, I've gotta hurry. I gotta grab an invis potion quick. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Yes, there it is. Just gotta grab this, throw it on my feet real quick, and sneak outside. I'm gonna cheat on behalf of the melon clone. <laughs> yes, this is gonna be awesome. All right, melon brother. Remember, every single game is worth 42 diamonds. Okay, guys. I'm pretty sure melon picked stone. Or did he pick paper? Oh, it doesn't really matter. I could just go check. He put paper. Okay, so now let me just play on behalf of the clone and grab the shears. That would have been awkward. And put the shears in here and it's go time. On go. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Wait, what? No, I lost! And how do you have a sword? I'm so confused. I could have sword. Alright, maybe I'm losing my mind. There's a sword in there. You win this game, brother, but you won't win the next. It's about to be even. Take back your stupid blade. I shall win this game of rock, paper, scissors. Guys, I know a psychology trick. Hey, Melon, I'm playing rock. And now, guys, I'm actually gonna play rock. Yeah, let's just check this one out for my clone. <laughs> he actually put the stone in there. What an idiot. And then I'll just grab the paper, and we'll just put paper in there, and it's ready to go. In three, two, one, go! No way! No, this can't can't be possible. No, I've lost twice in a row. I won't stop until I've won. Tomorrow. What the heck? I've lost 169 games in a row. I'm so broke. I don't even have a dispenser anymore. Yo, guys, this was so perfect. He lost to his clone so many times that I have all of his diamonds now. This is awesome. I'm actually broke. I'm gonna have to go hit the mines. This is not good. I think this is a pretty good time for me to go upgrade this device with Quandale. Let's grab the clone and head to the shop. Hey, Quandale, it's time for you to tinker with this device and upgrade it, please. All right, next time you use this device, it should spawn a lifelike clone, which will be aggressive. Wait a second. That is awesome. Yo, I'm going to create clones that attack Melon. Later. Guys, this is perfect timing. Melon just got back from his mining trip and he's sleeping. 
<laughs> Time to use the cloning device to create an aggressive melon. And in three, two, one, clone! Yo, it worked! There's another big man melon! Yo, what's up, brother melon? Yeah, me and Sonny play that knuckle- Okay, you can chill, you're gonna kill me. This is just a knuckle sandwich joke game, right? You're gonna kill me, stop, that's enough! Why? <laughs> You guys look at the chat. Big Man Melon was slain by Big Man Melon. This is awesome. Dude, dude, stop. Stop it, bro. Stop it. This is not funny anymore, brother. You were so cool yesterday. Now you look different and weird. Stay away. Hey, Melon. Hey, how are you? Bro, you're being really sus. Oh, yeah. hey, Melon. Uh, how are you? I'm good, bro. But my brother's being really weird, and he's trying to kill me over and over again. Like, the first time was kind of funny, but now it's just annoying. Yeah, I hate when that happens, dude. Dude. Hey, sounds like it's your problem, though. I've got stuff to take care of. Well, it's our problem. He's in our room. Sorry, Melon. It's the middle of the night. Uh, I've got a hot date coming up with Melanie. Yeah, no, no, Sonny, that's literally Cap. You know Melanie thinks you're annoying. Okay, so I know the cloning device is set for Melon right now, but maybe I could try using it on myself. Yo, it worked. Wait, why is he aggressive? No, 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 no. Chill, chill. We are friends. We are the same. We are literally the same. Chill. Okay, I don't like this. I don't like this. I'm bringing it back to Quandale for an update. That's it. But first, I'm gonna spawn more melon clones inside of our house. Go! 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 I have a big man melon set. What the heck? What is going on? Yo, yo, yo. This is not good. Why are there so many? Why are there so many? I don't think these are my brothers anymore. They look more like clones. Stay away! Stay away! No, I can get... Oh... Wondell, I need an update on this device ASAP. Things are going pretty wrong with it. Mm. Let me take a look at that. Ah, it's permanently stuck on aggressive mode, and it won't let you spawn any regular passive clones. I'll work on it and tell you when to come back again. Okay, okay, I'll give you a couple of days so you can fix it up. I'll be back in 72 hours, Quandale. Melon! Melon, where are you? There's so many of you out here! Sonny, what are you talking about, bro? I'm stuck in my room! I need help! There's wild melons on the loose, and they're trying to kill me! I was trying to tell you about that earlier, but you didn't listen to me! This is not good. This is very... Very bad, bro. Well, the room's safe, so if you can make it up into the room, maybe we can think of a plan to defeat whatever these things are. Yeah, good idea. I'm almost up. I'm almost up. Ah! Ah! Close the door! <sighs> okay, Sonny. What are we gonna do here? Do you know anything about these things? How do we get out? I have no clue. I don't even know why they're here. It's also really strange that they're even here. Like, who would do something like that? Like, it just doesn't even make sense, you know? Oh, well, thank God I have you to trust. Sonny, my only compadre in this world. I think we just give the house to them as a peace offering and go out the window. Uh, yeah, that's not a bad idea. Because <laughs> these are uh, pretty dangerous clones, you know? No, Sonny, you left the door open! Why'd you leave the door open? Yeah, that's your problem. I'm gonna eat these melon slices and watch you run off into the sunset. Ah! Stay away! 72 hours later. Whew, it's been a few days. I think all the clones have left the house now. I think it's fine. Finally safe. <laughs> There's a clone head. I'll just put that there. I've just got to grab a little food out of the fridge and go visit Quandale. I wonder if Melon's going to ever return home. Meanwhile, guys, the mountains are my home now. The only place where the clones can't get to me. Yo, Quandale, it's been three days. Oh, yeah. It's now updated to the Clone Creator version 3.0. Now you can create clones and control them from a separate control room located in the basement of the store. Oh, this is awesome. You're the best, Quandale. I've made it to the secret base. Look at this place. The Melon Clone Factory. This is awesome. This is perfect. All I have to do now is create a melon clone. It actually worked. Check it out. The perfect clone. And now I send this clone to Melon. It's working. It's working. He's gone. Ah, oh, what a beautiful view. Hey, Melon. Ah! Oh, God. 
god, oh god, the clones, they've learned to climb the mountains! No, you need to relax! I was sent here to become you! What does that even mean? I'm friendly! Everything's been fixed! The cloning device works great now, see? You're right, you're actually talking to me, and you're not trying to kill me! This is awesome! High five! You're giving me flashbacks, please don't punch me anymore. What do you want to do first, clone buddy? What do you want to do first? Hey, what do you want to do first, melon buddy? What do you want to do first? Hmm. I'm thinking. Hmm. I'm thinking. That we. That we. Yo, guys, my clone has been teasing Melon this whole time by copying his every move. Hit the most epic jump of all time. Follow me. Ow. I'm right behind you. And that's why I'm the better version of myself. And that's why I'm the better version of myself. Chill, 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 chill. I have half a heart. Calm down, okay? You're my clone, remember? You're like the worst version of me. But you're still pretty awesome because you're Melon. Yeah, calm down. I have ten hearts. And remember, you're the worst version of me because I'm the new and improved Melon. And I want to give you a nice, delicious knuckle. Yo, it looks like the clone wants to become the real melon. He thinks he's the new and improved 2.0. No! Uh, so, clone buddy, you want to hand back that axe and then we can go explore the world together? Ah, uh, clone melon, you want to hand back that axe so we can explore together? Um, thank you. Okay. He actually gave me back the axe. I was really worried he was going to keep it and murder me with it. All right, Melon. Let's go plant the biggest and most awesome melon field of all time. I bet you mine will be bigger than yours. I bet you it's going to be more awesome. Yo, Melon Clone. I have a great idea. Let's go plant the biggest, most epic melon patch of all time. That's literally what I just said. Also, I'm not a clone. You're the clone. Don't forget that. Hey, don't forget you're the clone and I'm the real new melon. And I'm gonna have a better melon patch. No, no, I'm the original. Whoever plants the better melon field is the original melon. Well, I'm the new melon. I've already said that. But whoever plants the better melon patch is the best melon. And the only melon. <laughs> There's only room for one of us. <laughs> Okay, uh, calm down. You're being weird. All right, let's do this. All right, guys, here's my melon field. Now, no melons have grown yet, but all good things take time. Within the next two weeks, I'll have eight ripened melons. What the heck is this? What is this? Hello, melon. Do you notice that I have the better melon farm? <laughs> and you see there's two skulls, right? How is this even possible? It takes at least two Minecraft days to grow a melon. What did you do? Not when you have the power of science on your side. <laughs> what is this? And you notice the two heads, right? What is that? Uh, clone melon? How did you do that? It represents you and me. And now there's only room for one melon in this town. Uh... Alright, I have the axe. I'll just kill you really quick. <laughs> Yo, they're about to fight! They're about to fight! Okay, I need to give him some gear. The sword. Just throw it into the transporter. Yep, he's gonna need this armor too. And full netherite armor. Just gotta ship it off now. Boop. Uh... I gotta get out of here! Oh. Die! I am the real melon! The new and improved melon bot! Calm down! Calm down! Yes! And now it's all mine. Dude, what the heck is going on? I gotta get to Quandale now. This is not good. A sentient melon clone that's trying to kill me! Quandale! What is he doing? What is happening? Quandale! Quandale, what's happening? Why is this clone attacking me? <laughs> Yo, Melon, this is one of the greatest pranks ever. This is so funny. What prank, bro? You literally murdered me. Actually, it wasn't me. It was your own clone. I might have created the cloning device with the help of Quandale, though. You helped him create a clone of me to harass and murder me? Actually, it was to get revenge because you ate my cake without permission. That's all of this because I ate your cake? Are you kidding me, sonny? What is wrong with you? That's it. That's it what? Huh? You gonna do something? Ah! What is that? What the heck is that? Guys, quickly like and subscribe! But you can't hide! <sighs>